can be played with a mouse or a gamepad. Uh, mouse. The font. Um, thank you so much, Python esque Calfi and Cad, for the 100 biddies a piece. I love Jurassic Park. I did not as love the recent ones. But I love the first two, definitely. I love The Lost World as well. Three is pretty good. I've only seen it a couple of times. But the original is just absolutely one of the best films ever, isn't it? Uh, Isla Nubla. Uh -huh. Wait, now you're really quiet. Give me some volume. Hey, let's make our menu so loud that they turn everything down. Oh, what? Am I supposed to be pushing buttons? What's happening here? arrow keys or WASD to search for objects to click. Okay. Click. Click. Hello? Did I do what? Click. I found it. Okay, I'm looking over there. How do I... I click it. You've well done. You have found an object. Click. Okay, look somewhere else then. I just... Did it say push a different button? Hang on. Is it because I alt tabbed out? Go back in. Go over there. Let's try gamepad, shall we? And see if that responds better than a mouse. Let's try the Switch controller. A good start. I just loved this music so much, I wanted to hear it again. What's up, hug? That was the old whipped cream canister, though, wasn't it? That he, uh, old Nedry smuggled the... I think it was DNA, wasn't it? Why won't you let me change the control scheme? Oh, shaving cream. I just won't alt-tab. Yeah. 
What is it? What are the things that their eyes light up? Is it a Trudon? to meet the target to steady your mind. <laughs> this is so bad. Oh my god. Why aren't you moving with the mouse then? Oh, there we go. Wow, mechanics. Some actions require a sequence of key presses. They're everywhere. Hold or tap, tap. Oh. She dead. To get up, click the icon and pull in the direction of the arrow. for this game is all over the place. Who's in the car? The intruder. I think she might be the intruder. Earlier that day. Say that again. We have a T-Rex. Yeah, it's a great view, but where are the dinosaurs? They I want to go watch that film again. I haven't seen it for so long, actually. Oh, yeah? Where'd you get those? Uh, these? Yeah, those. Those. That, um, guy gave them to me, your boss, John Hammer, or whatever. John <laughs> Hammer! That was generous of him. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, see ya. No dinos. Just look around. John look Hammer. Imagine if that's because they couldn't get the license to the name. Just, just have them call her. Call him John Hammer. Um. Thanks so much for the 250 bits. A ghost. Hey, there's a zoom thingy on here. We spare no expense. Hey, there's a dinosaur shaking that tree. Oh, forget it. Just some birds. Yeah, boring birds. What's that yellow flower? It's kind of like Mom's Bird of Paradise, only, you know, healthy. Sounds like Heliconia. We imported them from the mainland to brighten up the place. Can we go down there and see the dinos up close? When I worked in San Diego, did I let you into the tiger enclosure? That was totally different. Besides, I was only like seven. Right. And you scared the daylights out of me. What's this? What's that little bunker building? Just a maintenance shed. For dinosaurs that need repairs? Yeah, sure. We like to keep them tuned up, you know. <laughs> that jokes. Wait, wait, I definitely see one. Oh, 
<laughs> he just ran away. Actually, it's a she. They're all female. So which way did she go? Hmm. Over here somewhere. Follow the footprints. The footprints go in the stream. Sure, the Triceratops went in for a dip. She must have come out somewhere. <laughs> There's a car down there. Must be Hammond's visitors. He's got some hotshot paleontologists here to see the park. I bet they get to see some dinos up close. Wow. Wouldn't it be like educational if I stuck around here another day or two? This is whilst you know, the movie's going on. Bit. Are you kidding me? She'd be like totally happy. Oh, come on. No, she wouldn't. Yeah, she would. I would be all over a real life Jurassic Park. That would be so cool. There's footprints coming out of the stream. You're on the right track. Where do they go? I see a... Oh, never mind. It's a rock. I see a rock. Oh. Over here? You guys have more flowers <coughs> <than you. coughs> Have I not learned? But it would be yeah, fun, flower, even right? if it all went wrong. I mean, what a way to go. On an adventure. How exciting. Okay, I see her. Wait, there's a bunch of them. Oh, awesome. They're fighting. I totally wanted to see this. Well, actually, it's more of a dominance display than a fight. You remember how patchy was when your mom got that new puppy? Lady Margaret's like that with the younger Triceratops. Seriously? Lady Margaret? Yep, that's what we call the Alpha. See those horns? They're more than three feet long. Good for fighting T-Rex, right? When did you get to see that? Look, oh, that's, that's a scary not gonna okay. happen. I'm busy enough without holding gladiator fights. Which reminds me, remember I said I've got a sick Triceratops to check on? I should get going. I'll drop you at the guest house. Really? Already? Yeah, Dad, yeah, a sick to Triceratops. The boat leaves tonight. It's totally I rad. Don't have any stuff. I, I He's like, actually, it's dying. Uh. Well, at least you got to see Triceratops fight. Actually, it was more like a dominance display. Smart ass. What happened to your voice, sir? Uh, smart ass. Smart ass. Why are we enjoying them fighting each other? What is this? Why are we so evil? Who enjoys animals fighting? Something wrong with you. I told you, Nedry isn't here. That bastard's probably stuck in a doorway somewhere. Don't worry about it. Plan B is ready. I have Plan B right here. Nedry's not gonna double cross us. The money's too good. I like no, that this links to the movie. She doesn't know anything she doesn't need to know. What, do you think it matters? Hey, guess who's on the line? It's Dodgson. I got Dodgson here. We have Lara Croft at home. She doesn't care. Come on. My contact's gonna be here any minute. That's referencing... is the guy that he delivers it to, right? Isn't it? When he's like... Hey, it's here. He's here. He's here. See, nobody cares. It's like that clip, isn't it? Does Ingen know you stole their jacket? This is a covert op. I gotta blend in. Yeah, so what about me? Just, uh, follow my lead. Though she kind of sounds like, uh, Michelle Rodriguez. What's in the photo? This. This is what's gonna make us both rich. It's what we're here to collect. Shaving cream. Uh-huh. Sure. Shaving cream. New dialogue available. Shaving cream? Doesn't your shaving cream have a time limit? Just relax. Chances are Nedry's gonna show up All at the last minute. Crew, please board the vessel. We'll be casting off shortly. Son of a... Okay, where would you rather be stranded for a night? Uh, Jurassic Anyone Park Island or Skull Island from King Kong? We need access passes to get past security. You have to choose one. Damn it, I gotta make a phone call to an idiot. Don't let anyone see you. Without those passes, we're cooked. Pretty excited for that next uh, King Kong Godzilla. Select the icon to explore. Hmm. Let's listen in. I looked in the envelope. I checked it twice. I'm telling you, they're not in there. I don't know what to tell you, Sarah. The envelope went out and kicked it over the side. 
you and your ridiculous code name. Emergency use only. This is an emergency. Right now. Uh, hang on. What? We should get going. Yeah, well, we can't get going without access passes. Dodson? Yeah, she must be freezing. I wouldn't do that. Anyway, I checked all my pockets. Are we really hiding from this guy? We've just been chilling on the dock. Let's yoink these. <laughs> Dude, guards are always so bad. We have to distract him somehow, I guess. If we get him to call him or something, yeah? That little smirk. A little smirk to herself. Right, now go back and make a call. That's great. Thanks a lot. Very helpful. Well, we're hosed. Maybe not. What do you mean? I got the guard's phone number. Call him and keep him busy. What, then you sneak past and I stay here? Well, that's not gonna work. No, Baboso. I can get us the access passes. Fine. What should I tell him? What's Baboso? Just keep him talking. Uh, hi, hi, yes. Uh, I'm calling from payroll. Uh, we've lost some death. Yes, distraction. Oh, no. Like I said, I worked the morning shift, but that was only as a fill-in because they were a man. Think. Yeah, but hold on. There's one more. Hey, I thought you said. Oh. Okay, that was good, but. Hey, hey, hold on a second. You work for me, remember? That means I Hold call the shot. You can't go that way. Hello there. Hi. Uh, uh, we have passes. Well, that's good. This is a storm evacuation. All non-essential personnel need to leave the island. You need to get on that boat. Yes. I, I mean, I, I have some uh, some essential... Who are you with? I'm I'm with you. I'm new. What about her? She's, she's, uh, she's with maintenance. <clears throat> go ahead. Tell him. This guy's the last. I do repairs. This storm? What exactly are you fixing? Ah, uh, fences. I fix fences. Rain or no rain, you've got to get them repaired. What's with the machete? It's... A tool. It's a good tool. All purpose. Cutting, pounding, you name it. Anchor up in five. All aboard now. I don't have time for this. Do you vouch for her? What? I said, do you vouch for her? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Move your butts. Next time you better let me do the talking. Yeah, because that went that was going us. really well, wasn't it? So. At least the rain's easing up. What a job. Oh, Ingen should have paved this whole island. Jane should never have come here. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why is she, is she about Mr. to just Chadwick? like chop his head off? What, you don't like my aftershave? I don't want any accidents. <laughs> oh. I have to time it, I guess. Jungle's dance here. Bumps! I like how it failed me without even showing me the button. I feel like a Jurassic Park island would be less scary than the Kong island, because the Kong island has all kinds of beasties on it. Whether it's from Peter Jackson's one or from the Skull Island recent movie, there's always so many more monsters. Like the giant leeches and like water monsters and stuff. I feel like I'd stand a better chance against dinos. I swear, if I fail this. What are we stopping for? Don't rush me. Eh. 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 Hmm. 
nailed it. Memory unlocked of watching a really old version of King Kong at my uh, granddad's place and finding it so sad when he died. What is this monstrosidad? Hinjin is ruining the island. Is it so important to keep people out? Uh, it's more about keeping things in. Leave the monkey alone. Just, no, just it's, it, it's just, it's sort of like a zoo. You know what I mean? Oh, I feel like the music is really loud. Let me turn that down a bit. Kind of overpowering a little bit. Bring the voices up a little bit. A zoo? For what? Don't don't worry about it. There's nothing you know dangerous in there. Just find find a way through. Ten thousand volts. Why so much? Probably just trying to Ten keep out the teenagers. Ten thousand years. <laughs> the bit where he pretends that it's on still and scares the yeah, kids. I bet that means the power's out, right? Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Ladies first. Yeah, it's crazy they haven't told her what's even in here. <sighs> oh, thank God. I, I mean, you know, it's just... Lead the way. Uh-oh. Velos. Spitters. What is it? ¿Qué es esto? Not paquero. Like a bird. But much too big. I, I told you, it's a zoo. All kinds of animals. Come on, get moving. We're close. Does he know, though? Because if he knows, why is that? he so chill? What was that? Why would he want to be in here? An animal. Something I've never heard before. Okay, well, let's... We, we should... Maybe neither of them, though. Oh. Okay. That animal, I know. We call him Mokupa. I hate this damn jungle. Look, this way. Wow. This is it. The signal's topped out. It's nearby. It's too dark. I need light. Where's your flashlight? So this is you we're going to retrieve. Right, right. Did I drop it? Did you see me drop it? After Nedry yeah. dies, I guess. Over there. There we go. Yeah, it's from the look, the East hey, Dock and everything. You get stuck or something? Nedry, you deaf? I'm not climbing that in my new Stavalis. Get yeah, the stick. I'm gonna go get around. Stick. It'll be faster. I didn't know this was gonna tie in so heavily. This is cool so far, honestly. Apart from you know the mechanics and that. Let's take a look. Somebody in there? Oh yeah, it got in the car with him, didn't it? That was so scary as a kid. Uh, maybe don't open it. Let's have a look in there first. When he gets in and then it's there and it just goes... And it like fans its neck out and then the whole car is shaking. So scary. What's up, Megan? What's up, Delise? Let's take a look. There it is. Oh. 
tired out, huh? I told you it was better to go around. Something just jumped me. He was on your friend here. Oh, that's disgusting. There was something feeding on him. What the hell kind of zoo is this? Listen, I told you, don't worry about it, okay? It was, it was just some animal. We'll get the canister and then we're out of here. Where is it? I can't find it! Hmm. Where's the canister? The shaving cream, where is it? It's nearby. You said it yourself. If it's not in the car, it could be anywhere within 300 meters. Crap. Oh, Dodson's gonna kill me. Is Dodson gonna kill me? Don't worry about him. Worry about that thing. I'm worried about it, okay? What am I supposed to do? You know we can't go back empty-handed. Look there. Look if where. he knows it's dinosaurs, he should be so much more scared. Prince, your man took a walk. We follow his trail they like tracking the... games. They do. That's they how are. we find the canister. Hi, Tulip. Thank you so much for the 1,000 bits. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Oh, but hold on. What if one of those, uh... Oh, okay, you look down there, and I'll I'll check the car again, just uh, just just in case. How you doing? Thank you so much for the support. I appreciate you. Who was uh, who was your favorite character in Jurassic Park? I've always had a thing for like side characters that never get any screen time. I loved Muldoon, the like hunter guy. I thought he was so cool. Clever girl. We're being hunted. It was just like, I don't know, he was so cool, even though he had like hardly any lines. That first film has a ton of great characters in it though. Samuel L. Jackson is awesome in that movie too. Jeff Goldblum, of course. I don't know if I appreciated Jeff Goldblum's role in that though as a kid, honestly. Oh, and the kids are so annoying, right? No canister here. The tracks lead that way. Yeah, Laura Dern's great in it. I had never clocked before until she won... I think she won an Oscar, right? I had never clocked that she was Bruce Dern's daughter before. I never put the, the name together. The man's car was stuck. He pulled the winch line down to find an anchor. Malone, that thing was stalking him. <laughs> I got munched. Mm -hmm. Where can I go? Oh. It will never be like it was. Interesting that she didn't know anything for her then to say they should have never come here. I wonder what her link is to the island then, if she seemed to be offended that they're here. Mr. Chadwick, you can help me with the lights on the car. No, listen, I'm I'm busy. Hmm. I started this. I'm gonna finish it. For the money. For you, mi amor. Yeah, I feel like I should go back to Peaky Blinders. I stopped watching it right before Tom Hardy's season. I don't know what one that is. But I watched a couple of the early ones. He belongs in an office, not a jungle. What kind of monstros are they keeping here? Doesn't Sam Neill just, like, live on a lake now and hug his goose? I feel like I just see videos of him every so often of... They're just like very wholesome, positive videos, him by his lake. He's Australian, isn't he? Wait, I don't see anything else to click on here. Oh, wait. Ah, in here. There we I see. Now I can move around. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
good old Tom. No human tracks here. Richard in the cave. Any bats in there? Can't be in here. He never made it this far. Alright, check somewhere else. Oh, wrong button. Hello, why does the menu take so long to come up? I am not gonna die for this mensa. I don't know I don't know what some of these things are that she's saying, but I enjoy them. Snack. It's a good anchor. He could have gotten free. Gotta find it. No, it's not uh, the stick that just he threw. Stick. Get the stick. Get the stick. I remember one of my birthdays, I went to see uh, The Lost World at the cinema in London, Leicester Square. It's so good. The tracks lead here, but it's too damn dark to see. Yeah, put the lights on, dude. Stop being a punk. Mr. Chadwick, you can help me with the lights on the car. No, listen, I'm, I'm busy. Just turn the lights on. Uh, is, maybe I'll go get a torch or something. Am I going to turn the lights on myself? Why, <laughs> I had to climb all the way back up here to do it myself. You absolute jerk face. Oh, man. Oh, Any luck? Tough. No. Tracks of yours better lead somewhere. Or we're never getting out of here. Hmm. <laughs> Just had someone come by your apartment selling meat door to door, creeped out. I feel like that's not super uncommon. It happens uh, occasionally with fish in London when people live by a river or something and the restaurants that they have stuff that they haven't been able to use up. You get people showing up selling the... He circled the tree with a winch line. Then something got interested. Something hungry. <laughs> in America it's weird, it's probably people. Selling some sweet meats. An egg. <gasps> Friggin' bugs! What? What's the problem? Nothing. Did you find it? The canister's not here. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm so screwed. No, we can't give up. His trail ends back at the car. You must have missed something in there. Not a chance. I turned that thing inside out. I'm gonna smell like a dead fat dude for a week. Fine, I'll take a look. I watched, I watched the uh, I use some fresh air. first dates Valentine's thing and one of the guys on it, he had a job, one of his jobs, he had a couple, but it was dealing with fish. I think he sold fish. And he said he just smells of fish all the time. And I was thinking there are, there are few things, there are few things that could be more of a turn off, I think on a first date than if your date just stank. 
like of strong fish like they've been working with fish the whole day that'd be so rough he was like oh i think i've got it out he'd been like scrubbing and i just think man just having to shower so much every day it'd be so hard to get it out you'd be scrubbing yourself raw you like your sweets hey gordito such a strong smell There he is, all munched up. No canister. Nothing. How long is this after the original story? I think this is, like, running parallel, since they said uh, there are some paleontologists on the island, and this is, like, just after Nedry gets killed. He was supposed to... We're the people he was supposed to come and meet. And, uh... You had a canister just about this size, didn't you? Here he you is. You didn't lose it down below. You had it with you. He came back to the car in a rush. He hit his head, and he fell. If he dropped the can... Where'd it go? Science. Physics. Oh yeah, it squelched on down. Did they ever actually cover what happened to this can in the movies? I can't remember. Wasn't it part of three, I want to say? I don't think it featured... Oh, baby! I knew I'd find you! The first one. excited about a can of soap. Yeah, it's a can of soap. Just like you're a repairman. Ten years of research. Millions invested. There it is. It's the next wonder of the world. You want to screw in, Jen? This is it. The crown jewels. They lose control of this, they got nothing. They're dinosaur embryos, honey. Don't tell me you thought we were after shaving cream. Dinosaurs? I don't understand. <laughs> you don't need to understand. I love how he's like, it's just a zoo, don't That'll worry. Keep them fresh. There's nothing to worry about. And then he's like, it's dinosaur embryos, baby. What? What's your problem? Time for you to die, I think. Don't move. Do not. Move. What? Why? Oh, crap. Is it gone? It's gone. Okay. Yeah. Did you see that? Pow. That's how you do it. <laughs> yeah! That's what you get, you little punk! Let's get out of here. Okay, all right. All right, you know the plan. My, my boys are sending a boat. We bring them the canister. We get paid. We go home. We cannot walk to the meeting place. Not with these monstros around here. Right. We'll take the car. Bring down the car. I'll, I'll stay here and uh, I'll cover you. Who's afraid now, huh? Would never trust this guy. Imagine working with a guy like that where you just think, he's 100% gonna just take my share. He's gonna leave me here. What's happening here? Hmm. Chadwick, move! No, no, this, this is the perfect time. Yes. Yes. The angle's covered. Another fire. I bet he survived. Damn. Hey, hey, you okay? You idiot! You nearly killed me! You should have paid attention. Huh. The, lights are gone. the lights are out! I can't see anything. I'm stuck. I can't see anything. I need light! I can't see! What was that? I need you to stay yeah. focused. Was that a dinosaur? My oh, God. No, okay. isn't no. it? No, all right. Oh, God. Don't you have okay. a backup plan? Oh, God, I don't want to be here. Miles. I don't want to get you. Miles! Shut up! Yeah! What? What? 
Calm down. Think of something relaxing. Are you freaking kidding me? I have a plan. Plan? What plan? First of all, give me the gun. Miles, give me your gun. My gun? That's that's funny. Give you my gun. <laughs> Fine. Uh, start the car. All we gotta do is start the car and drive out of here. Start the car? Oh yeah. Oh, okay. I can't. It won't. It won't start. Now what? Try the key. Try it again. Maybe it'll start. I tried it again. It's not gonna start. You can fix it. Me? I don't know crap about cars. I have a guy do that for me. Hmm. I I'll guess I'll fix, fix it. it. You gotta fix the car in the dark? That's right. That's a loose battery cable. What does that mean? <laughs> what? What? Loose? Battery? Speak English, woman. What are these things you speak of? She's a witch. She's a witch. Did you check the, uh, the valve? Hang on, wait. The guy who does my port, he, he always checks the valve. Shut up. Where am I supposed to hold it? Where it's tingling? Or in the... Can you please pick up the pace? I don't know where I'm doing. Keep it in the middle, maybe. I think you should hurry. Yeah. Yeah. I don't I think know. You should hurry. What's the idea? What's the idea here? The, uh, Thank you, Hug, the for valve. the hundred biddies. The guy who does my porch, he, he always checks the valve. Shut up. I feel like I should be keeping it where it's working, right? Move. Hold, move the mouse, find the right spot, hold it there, and connect the battery. Can it's so hot, it moves so much. Oh, I feel like this would be easy yeah. with a gamepad. Yeah. yeah, you should hurry. That's it. Let me get it tight. <gasps> bum, 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 bum. There we go. I feel like slapping someone like that would be satisfying, for sure. What? There. Oh, God. Time to food. I would 100% throw him to them and use that distraction to escape. There are too many of them. What do you suggest? We have to draw them away. Distract them. Distract them? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm on it. Here you go. Oh, see, so you gotta get him before he gets you. Karma. We'll call that one Karma. Leave him. Ah. Tumbled and... Oh, whoops. Ah! You died. Death toll, one. Oh my god, it has a built-in... Death counter. That's cool. That will stay at zero. Ah, uh, two. I pressed it. I 100% pressed it. The same again. Down, right. Aww. 
Yo, I did it! This is gonna be annoying. Go. I'm gonna do this. What's this? Glitch. How to drive. And then what about an I think this is the first game they did with this style. Um, oh, poor baby. Which is interesting to see, like, the development of it. Oh, I forgot his body was in the car next to us. How grim. Huh. Just making sure he's dead. Do you think? No. Oh, oh, this is where it started. It's Trudon's. Damn, that looks nasty. That tore us up. It's weird that they started with that chase scene because it's not like it was that exciting. CD player. In terms it's of fine, scripting, they won't leave without us. us. You're coming to Dallas? Oh, just to the mainland. I, I have to be back. They could have the easily storm. just started with us on the dock. I'll drive you to the airport. Or with these two. Cool. That's weird. Fence lights are out. Is that a bad thing? I'm sure it's fine. Somebody just needs to replace them. So, how's uh, school and kid stuff? Look, Jess, I've been working so hard. We just, we haven't had much time to talk. Uh-oh. Jess, your mom told me about the, the shoplift. <gasps> I was just fooling around. Tea leaf. I didn't take anything good. What did she say? That's not the point that you didn't take anything good, you little thief. Why did you do it? Honey, I know Westlake is boring, but there's plenty going on in Dallas. Why do you have to steal stuff to have fun? I know, I know, I'm a screw up. Sweetheart, no, <laughs> no, it's, it's not that at all. I Acting just, like she's done the worst thing in I the world. I want you to promise me. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a damn screw up. Ah! Damn it. I'm the worst. Oh my God, is she dead? No, no, she's alive. She's breathing. Hello, can you move? This is strange. It's like some kind of... Oh. She needs medical attention. We've got to get her to the visitor center. Yeah, she stepped right out. Oh, it's she, fine, I've got dash know? cam. I don't recognize her, she but can't it doesn't sue. Were you serious when you said you can drive a stick? Oh well, yeah, I, I can do it. Mom doesn't know, but... That's all right. Just get yourself up front. Try not to scare me. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go. Come on, sweetheart. We got to get her out of here. Yeah, why? You know what's here, sir. Why are you even letting your kid get out of the car to check on this lady? You would have said, stay in the car. Worst dad. Did we hit her hard? Hard enough, but we didn't do this. And why this does is, the kid need to drive? I'm going to check her vitals. Just Listen, it's real important that you drive, kid. Right. I need to cradle okay. this lady like no a baby in the backseat. All right. 
What is this? What? Looks like she's been bitten. Bitten? Y you mean, like, by a dinosaur? I don't know. Uh, the bruising is showing evidence of toxins, but <laughs> this isn't a Dilophosaurus. First time watching you live? Well, dinosaurs are poisonous. We're having a great week. I think I want to be out here anymore. Yeah, we need to get her to the visitor center. Try hello? She's bradycardic. Heart rate's only 33. Oh, she's burning up. <laughs> Whispering in her ear. Um, What's with their eyes? <laughs> No. Bink. It's it's like a reaction to a parasitic infection to God, I don't know, maybe maybe toxoplasmosis. That doesn't explain the other symptoms. You're like, hey, I'm sleeping. Come on. Stay yeah. with me now. Jesse, I gotta clean this wound up. Just keep driving smoothly. Okay. Get on drive. And Shell, thank you so much for the gifts up. Very generous, very kind. Antiseptic. Okay, this might sting a bit. It's okay. It's okay. Settle down. Come on, please. I need to clean this up. Sure, let me do it. Let me say something. Hey, listen to me. You need to let me help you. Alejate de mí. No, no, listen. I'm a doctor. I'm gonna make it better. Doctor? Medico? Yes, Medico. I'm going to disinfect your wound now, okay? You gotta let me help you. <laughs> Well, that should keep the infection at bay. That's nasty. I don't know what you were doing out there, but... Dad? It's okay. She's going into shock, but I can handle it. I can stop it. Oh my it. god, this is bad. Just watch the room. And don't think we're done talking about your shoplifting, missy. Gotcha. Keep your eyes on the road. Rare. <laughs> also find out our kids like just totally into shooting up heroin as well. Oh man. Why are you so interested in needles, huh? She's a rebel. Oh god, this is the stuff with the mouse is actually really hard. Oh wow, it's car's jumping around too much. I can't give a clean injection. Just pull over for a minute. bumpy for a clean injection. Doesn't help that we're pushing 35. Oh, tell her to slow down. Jess, listen, I gotta give her an injection. It's important that I access the vein. Oh, I, I don't need details. Just slow down so I don't miss. Mm. Needle's not that big. It's pretty fat, though. It's pretty thick. <sighs> well, that should keep her stable. Okay, I'm gonna get her bandaged up. You okay to keep driving? Yeah, I'm good. Tell mom I'm ready for my learner's permit, okay? <laughs> I don't think mom needs to know about it. How There's some pretty doing? good uh, well, voice acting okay in this so far. For now. But this toxic alteration just doesn't make sense. Dad. Maybe some of the dinosaurs are eating poisonous Dad. plants. Jess, why are we stopping? Having a munch. She's beautiful. <laughs> she, right? Right. Well, we're lucky this young one's by herself. Wouldn't want to meet the alpha out here. Lady Margaret, she's uh, pretty protective. We've discovered that family groups emerge even without the usual genetic relationships. Young Triceratops join the family dad, the moment they. You're ruining it. Right. <laughs> Sorry. Classic this dad. His name is Bakita. What is she doing way out here? Like, I, I'm still... I'm dying in your arms. I thought we were going to the hospital. I, I've got to get this critter back in her enclosure. Why are we having a lesson about dinosaurs? I'll just be a sec. Wait here. Yeah. Oh, that is so cool. Easy, girl. Musa Kalamusa, huh? You really love this stuff, don't you? Bum, bum, bum. There's been some pretty good Jurassic Park games. The, um... It was Frontier, wasn't it, that did the theme park builder that we played? What was it called? Uh, Jurassic... Wasn't it just called Jurassic World Evolution or something? That was fun. 
when you build your own Jurassic Park. How did you get out here, huh? Did you push this gate open? Which I think they gave away for free on Epic not too long ago, but we had uh, we had a good time streaming that when it came out. Come on, girl. Get moving. Hmm. Hey, honey, how's our patient doing? I don't know. <laughs> okay, I guess. How's her breathing? Okay, I guess. She's kind of snoring. <laughs> I think she swallowed her own tongue, Dad. I Maybe the Triceratops can wait? I don't know. She's like, I'm 14. I, she looks dead. What's wrong with the gate? It's locked in the open position. There should be a manual release in the shed, but didn't I say to wait in the car? Yeah, what are you Is doing? The There's dinosaurs See? here. We're all right. We're fine. Right? She's pretty cute, huh? She's warm. I didn't He's like, I know this is dangerous, but God, I really need to bond with my kid here. She's okay. She's all right. She's just getting to know you. I right, need to be the cool dad. dad. Okay. Look, I need to get this girl out of the way. Now that you've met her up close, would you please go back to the car? Are you kidding me? New faces make her nervous. She'll be a lot easier to I manage. Need her, if you're I need in her the to car. go back to her mum with a really oh, cool story. Right. I need her okay. stepdad to hear how great I am. Out of the way, and I need to unlock the gate from the maintenance shed. What's in there? Apart from the release lever for the gate, just maintenance stuff. Uh, I don't know how we never got a scary survival boots, Jurassic Park shovels. though, like snow Dino shovels? Crisis. What for? Well, it's not for shoveling snow. Oh. It'd be so ew. perfect. Should be a manual for this in the car. For a keypad? Jesse, look at the glove box for me. There should be a manual in there with access codes to the shed. Okay, just a sec. <laughs> ah. Find those codes? Is it in this little black book thingy? Yeah, look for the access codes for the Triceratops maintenance shed. Uh, okay. One five six three three seven. Three three seven. Okay, thanks, sweetheart. Thanks, sweetie. Do it now to get Bakita away from her snack. Bakita. Right, what are we gonna do with you? Gonna get the horns. Oh, what happened there? But I could use a better idea. I'm working on some. She could uh, beep the horn and uh, distract. Jess, just try the lights or the horn or something. Anything to get her attention. Okay. How kind. Right, I'm waiting for you to beep. Child. <laughs> Do it myself. Okay. Let me change back to dad. Oh, maybe turn the light if off you too. Can get her to back up. I can get at her food. The lights. Oh wait, get her to look and then do the lights, maybe. Well, don't just look at me. Move your butt. All right, you got her away from the branch. 
Okay. Bum bum. Now you can get this snack. Taking his sweet time. There you go. Back where you belong. Now I can close that gate. Bum, bum, bum. My mouse, this is one of those games where my mouse is constantly, when I move it to the left, it goes off the screen onto my other monitor, onto chat. So just shout if I accidentally ban somebody or something. When I'm moving it, I end up over there somehow. It don't lock it on, because it's old. Two thousand and eleven. Uh, no, Get back in there. Ten years ago, I guess. Jess. I'm on it. Undecade. Where were you? Oh no, the Alpha. Jess, shut off the horn. That's my baby. That is. You've been picking up my baby, have you? Get a load of this, then. Oh no, Dad. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Uh oh. That didn't help. The lady in the back, though. Oh, I love this song. <laughs> Damn it! Ah! Uh, please stop the horn. Stop the horn. one's going to save us. Ah. Oh, oh no. did it in time, but I guess not fast enough. Huh? Oh, I'm pressing space to, like, skip, but it just keeps coming here. would be terrified, wouldn't it? Although I don't think they actually looked these this scary in real life since then, don't they? They say that they were probably fluffy and feather-covered and... Created with being a monster in mind. Oh! I. What do you want me to do? How am I supposed to do this any faster? Good 
darkness. You okay? Whoa! Oh, I mean, it's so much easier with a controller. Like X's and O's. Also, way to go crawling into its path, Father. Go quick. Quick, quick, quick. Quick taps, quick taps. Up, down, down. Up, down, down. Is it the same every time? I think it is. Good job, Dad. Whoa, look out. Oh, why would you put yourself in this situation? Go. Damn it. Get her out of here. Oh. You said you wanted to see a fight. Oh, whoops. <laughs> oh, no. I. I mean, I kind of want to see what happens if I fail. Should we see? He just didn't even, he didn't even look upset, he just looked disappointed. We'll be safe inside the maintenance shed, but... Okay! We're in just safe! Damn it! Oh. scene overall. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. How about you? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. I'm okay. What about her? Well, <coughs> two arms, two legs. <laughs> the heavy breathing. <laughs> and I just like hasn't stopped for the last two minutes. Breathing away. This has been more fun than I thought it was going to be, not going to lie. Well, that should get her through the night. What's left of it? Tomorrow, we'll get her proper treatment. It's kind of like... It's a thin line between it, like, being uh, quite fun, but also, like, a bit of a, a B-movie element to it as well, where it is kind of silly and the characters are quite loud. Um, but it's... Come on, Jesse. We're safe now. Been fun. Yeah. She she doesn't she doesn't love me at all. She doesn't respect me as a father. That reminds me of your old honey bear nightlight. Remember that? You wouldn't go to sleep without it. Yeah, dinosaurs can't get through that door, right? I thought he was about to do like a puppet show. Shadow puppets on the wall. Well, they could try, but they couldn't possibly fit through. 
Dad? Yes, sweetheart. Remember how I said I wanted to see the dinosaurs fight each other? Yeah. That was so awesome. Get some sleep, honey. <laughs> <sighs> He's like, ah, oh, you don't even you don't even get the gravity of the situation, I child. Like to see the baby. We almost died. You're unbelievable, kid. But I'm bum bum. Done. Escalante, thank you so much for the prime resub and the baby resub. Thank you very much. Oh, what have we got here? My mic keeps moving. Yeah, this kid's messed up. The thrill of shoplifting wasn't enough. Quite old that character, what do you think? 50 50 something? 54? That feeling when your kid constantly finds way to disappoint you in a dino park. I know. Pesky kids. I'm just pushing buttons. I don't even know. I should have looked through the thing first. This bird Ooh. just trolling everyone. Don't shoot it. What are you? I feel like it's following the uh, the lady. Thank you, sheeps, for the hundred pennies. I'm not sure Lady Margaret made it. Oh, right. Wow. This isn't supposed to happen. One loose trike, okay, but a Tyrannosaur? That's beyond unacceptable. I gotta talk to Muldoon and the security team. Uh-oh. Are you gonna bring the hammer down? Look, whoever let this happen has to be held accountable. Yeah, I'm gonna bring the hammer down. The John cool. Hammer. So, how are we gonna get to the visitor center? Hmm. Listen, you stay here, look after our friend. I'll hike out for help. Uh, or, or maybe we should stick together. Yeah, right. Sure. <laughs> what? What do you mean, sure? Well, at least the main power Who's in charge on. here? That should be good for something. And we have video. How did you do that? It's an easy hack. The system's held together with spit and bailing wire, like everything else in this damn park. Looks like we're not the only ones who missed the boat. They won't last long in the open. Let's get them out of there. How do we get to them? We're miles away, and the access road is washed out. We may be stuck here in the boondocks, but those two are standing right on the main tour loop. Watch this. Yeah, watch this. Nedry land. Tour vehicles. Send them a car. Ah, here we go. I just hope the system's online. Error. Error. Damn it. Okay, fine. I better get security access. She just loves dinos. Look at her doodles. It's a Unix system. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Is it? I actually don't know what that means. Hammond supplies late again. Parasaur, communication, danger, mating, food. Um, access, security. <laughs> security, Run. access. You didn't say the magic word. No. Oh, Dennis Nedry. You want a magic word? Please. Just for you. Oh. Scissora. Sushinkimbum. Seer and dirty. Studgery. Of course. Studgery. All right, we've got access. Let's see what we can do with it. 
Right. We've already got access. Oh. I'll be damned. They must have cycled main power. Why would they do that? Mysterious nose. Who is she? Who is she? Hey, have you guys ever used a neti pot? What's a what's good for like allergies and or sinuses? My sinuses have been like really bad the last week or so. I'm pretty sure it's why I've been getting those migraines. The change in the weather or dust or something. I need to dust in here, but also thinking about getting something. What shaman I can do? Is it good for sinuses like and it. allergies? I just literally feel like lately I can only breathe through one nostril like at a time. Catastrophic failure. How long have I been saying this whole park is doomed to catastrophic failure? Pretty long. But one of these junk heaps is still working. All right, let's see which one. Oh yeah, some of you use them. Pretty good, weird feeling. I use one. It's great. Flushes you out. That sounds like it might be good. Okay, little lambs, just wait right there, and I'll send a car to fetch you. Dun, 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 dun. Fresh new car. Welcome aboard. Hello. <laughs> Somebody knows we're here. Honestly, starting to think I might be allergic to my cats. Never, ever hitchhike. Except when you're on an island full of dinosaurs. Come on, honey, let's get our patient. I have fav ha hay fever, but I, I mean, that's not around at the moment. I don't know what's been causing me to Where struggle lately. These tour cars only go a few places. If you can hear us, we need to go to the visitor center. Looks like one of them's hurt. I'm surprised it's only one. Let's get him to the center. Maybe I should take Here some antihistamines. Can't this car go any faster? It's gonna take forever. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, I've been doing like the massages with it as well. Oh yeah, she looks really ill. You've been in an accident. You're safe now. You're gonna be fine. We're taking you to. Bastardo! Moridas por tus pecados. Calm down. What's happening? She's delirious. She could be hallucinating. Mariquita. Angelito mío. She says I I'm, I'm her angel. Hola, ¿cómo estás? No sabes cuánto he esperado. Jess, just keep talking to her. Tell her she needs to relax. She's got to rest. My Spanish isn't that good. You can do it, honey. Just just tell her tranquilo, she needs to rest. Tranquilo, tranquilo. Mariquita. ¿Qué pasa, mi amor? Uh, uh... Uh... Yogurt. Yogurt? Don't... Evita. Evita. La Biblioteca. La Biblioteca? Yogurt Evita La Biblioteca. <laughs> Yogurt avoids, avoids the library. Oh, this is great. No, wait. I didn't say that quite right. Uh, Tio. Tio. Odia. It's probably La Resta, right? But I want to see what these other ones are. Le de de el Descanso. El Descanso? Tio Odia El Descanso. No vale la pena odiar. El odio fatiga. <laughs> Oops. Uncle hates rest. Okay, uh, Usted. Usted. Uh, necesita. necesita. Un lapis. Un lapis? Usted necesita un lapis. Un lapis? This kid's just sick in the head, just trying to trip her Tell out her even she more. She needs rest. Yeah, I got it. You need a pencil. You need a pencil. L? L, come. Uh. La Biblioteca. La Biblioteca? El come la biblioteca. 
de qué estás he eats the library okay, and he's going to right. eat you next so I guess it's Usted? this and then wait so what would this one be need Necesita. rest la resta Usted necesita la resta. oh no la resta. oh what happened to your neck I think La Resta doesn't mean what I thought it did. Okay. Usted necesita. That one. El descanso? Usted necesita el descanso. El descanso? Si, si, estoy cansada. Huh. I thought you got all A's in Spanish. Yeah, I kind of forged that. Sorry. Why does she have a belt on her neck? Look! I think this is our stop. Ah, the old center. This concludes our tour. Don't forget to visit the gift shop on your way home. That is messed up. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that sky. Hey, can somebody help us, please? Oh, Hello? is this... This is after the Rex has been in here, then. Because, look, it's smashed. When the... What happened? Where is everybody? So this is after the end of the first film. Because isn't that, like, pretty much the last shot is the Rex saving them from the Raptors, isn't it? The Rex always becomes the good guy in these movies. You know what? I bet they're out. They're probably out fixing fences. Jess, I think you should stay by our patient. I'm going to look around a little, okay? Okay, but why are you talking like that? Someone's trying to contact us, right? It's coming from the PA system. They must be broadcasting on the emergency channel. Hang on, I'm going to So many this great down. scenes. Just seeing that raptor there makes me think of when they're in the kitchen. Sneaking around and the raptor's stalking them. That's such a amazing scene as well nothing here that sickle claw in the second digit velociraptor what the hell happened here what the heck what the heck mm -hmm. oh the helicopter was them leaving with the last scene with the pterodactyl yes I think you're right Na, 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 na. He's like, I don't think I'll be endorsing your park. What a mess. We've seen better days, huh? Nope. What have we got? They look so harmless in the picture. Do they? How's our patient? Pretty much the same. She doesn't look so good. It's great. I love that they decided to cut this mechanic, as far as I know from their later games, the whole moving around thing and just streamlined it more into an interactive movie was how they did their games after this one. This feels like the hybrid, obviously, between their point and click with well, Back to the Future. That does not look normal. And then into this style, and then they just went all in on... Uh, are you one of the nice dinosaurs? Like the kind that didn't try to step on me last night? Play the movie. Oh. It's gotta be safer in here than out there. See what's the uh, where's the sound coming from? What happened? Hold on. 
seriously messed up. There's a radio in there. Can I help? You got it. Let's get this channel right. <gasps> Can I help? You got it. Find the frequency. Hello? Hello? This is Jerry Harding. I'm the chief veterinarian. I know who you are. This is Laura Sorkin. I hope you enjoyed the ride. Dr. Sorkin, you're still on the island? We're stuck in the field lab. The road's washed out and our phone lines are down. What's your story? We saw a T-Rex on the tour road. My daughter and I are lucky to be alive. Do you know what's going on? Security went down last night. Naturally, the park's going to hell. Looks like Hammond already evacuated. I don't think he meant to leave us. No, of course not. Yeah, I'll try to call the mainland not. from here. They'll send a helicopter. But first, not. Doctor, I've got a very, very foe. sick woman on my hands. She seems to have been bitten. I, I don't recognize the bite. Whatever it is, it's incredibly toxic. toxic. And is it a ragged wound? Heterodont bite pattern about 20 centimeters across the jaw? That sounds about right. What about her eyes? Discolored sclera, opsoclonus? Yes, exactly. That's exactly what I'm Damn seeing. It. You don't have much time. She's going to go into a series of convulsions and she won't come back. Uh -huh. Do you have any carfentanil? I don't. No, I don't, but what good would that- I don't have time to explain. A quarter mil should do it. Uh, Dr. Sorkin, small. with all due respect, that dosage would kill Dr. her. Dr. Harding, you've got to trust me on this. You need a powerful tranquilizer to counter the toxins. You need it quick. All right, if you want uh, to... all right, okay, uh, maybe in the lab. No, no wait, the trank darts for the rifle. That's an atorphine blend. That could work. Get that into her as quick as you can. In the meantime, stay with her. When the shaking starts, you need to hold her steady. Isn't that dangerous? I mean, normally if someone's having a seizure... Please, just follow my instructions. Her life depends on it. Call me on this channel after you've given her the tranquilizer. Will do. I need to move that woman so I can work on her, and I'm gonna tranquilizer need... Tranquilizer darts. Yeah, I heard. They're in the car. I'll get them. Okay, but listen to me. If you hear anything, see anything, don't take any risks. You just come straight back here. Don't worry. I'm on it. Don't worry, father. I'm a sociopath. I feel nothing. I fear nothing. Oh. Oops. Wait, can I make her fall down the stairs? What happens if I just... <laughs> why is that... What, what, why is failing a quick time event make her hurt herself on the stairs? What, what the heck was that? Ah, twisted my ankle! I just want to see what happens. It makes no sense. Doesn't know how to walk. Uh. <gasps> oh. Waste your time looking. What a strange scene. What's up, Apollo? How you doing? Dad, where are you? Jess, get out now! What? He's back. Oh. Oh, no. It's getting worse. Dad, I need those trank darts. Help your child, sir. Dad, I can get the darts. 
No, Jess! Just get out of here! I'm not leaving you! <laughs> You're not going to last much longer, are you? <laughs> Ominous. <laughs> Just hold on. Timed. Timer. Cause a distraction, Dad. It's gonna take more than that to get its attention. Hmm. Like the old switches. Well, howdy, little paleontologists. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Are you ready to see some dinosaurs? Ah, oh, Mr. I can't DNA. Hear you. Push more. We got. I gotta get it away from Jess. What's this? Dr. Sorkin, we need some help. <laughs> Not yet, but. I'm using a Son of a. an idiot. Shout at it. Hey! You! Up here, right Do here! Do the gold bloom. Oh. It's not working. Don't have anything else here. Check with the kid. A bit closer, and then he can drop one on its head. There we go. Go, 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 go. Okay, move it a bit. Move it a little closer, honey. A direct hit. A little closer, honey. I don't think that way is going to help. It's blocking the way, though, for me to get... Oh, it moved. Okay, that's got to be there, right? I really is a bad dad. Knows how to use stairs, father. I got it. Give me the dart. Just hold her still. Just a drop. Thank. Dramatic T Rex. How did we get on the roof? Jess, stay down. Jesse! <laughs> uh. yes. I want to see what happens. 
I'm just gonna fail everything. I think. I'm right here. I'm stuck. Just let go, honey. It's not that far. I'll catch you. Okay. It's really not. It's really not that far at all. Don't be stupid. Jess, you're not thinking. Listen to me. There's only one way to do this. All right, listen to me, honey. I'm going to count to three, and you're going to let go. And I'm going to be right here. I'm going to catch you, okay? Another uh, okay. throwback to the okay. movie. Good. One. Oh! <laughs> oh, that was so good. That was better than I could have ever imagined. Help me. I didn't even mean to do it that time. Okay. So good. Up, up, there we go. Down. Up. I'm doing it! I'm pressing the right one, it has to be so quick. Dad! Oh, she's feeling better. Oh no! <laughs> the worst place you could be. Get some narco berries. Oops. Uh, Southern Lady with the 22 months. Thank you so much for the resub. I appreciate you. Hope you're doing great. T-Rex said, I'm the daddy now. Yoink. This is, this is T-Rex from Children's Services. I understand you've been a bad dad. Enough dinosaurs. In that case, why are we in a cave now? Come on, I need to make a phone call. Five years. We found you last night. We sort of, like, ran into you. Maldita sea. So, who is Mariquita? Mariquita? It's, it's nobody. A word. Oh, 
My Spanish is so lame. I was trying to talk to you in the car, and it's like, I thought you were gonna kill me because my grammar sucks. So, um, what did we talk about? Help's on the way. The control room's a mess, but the phones are working. Hey, you look a whole lot better. Help is on the way? Ian Jen is sending a rescue team. A helicopter will be little, here soon to take us to the mainland. Tree, Father. We'll get you looked at by a people doctor instead of a vet. A rescue team? Engine. My things. I had a pack. Oh, it's right here. <sighs> uh... That bite on your arm. What happened? Something in the jungle. Take it slow. Start from the beginning. I do repairs. They call me in because I'm the best. You know what? I don't have time for this. Seeing her boots there, I saw the coolest oh, well, custom little nightmares trainers on Etsy. There won't be any rescue. I started looking at custom. Oh! Not for you. How ungrateful. How ungrateful! Is that the end of the episode? Ah. How rude. And uh, as you know, I'm, I'm just like so sad that there's never any cool sneakers in my size. I was absolutely gutted that I couldn't get these. The, the, the custom hand-painted ones only seem to go up to... Sound? It just randomly put the sound onto a different fader at the start of the second episode. This game's so busted. Um... They only went up to like a US 12, which was a shame, but they had a lot of cool, cool ones. I guess, would you really wear them anyway if you bought them? Maybe you would just put them on a shelf or something. <laughs> Who's this? New characters. Yoda. So who did get left behind on Dino Island? Oscar, you have the list. Remind Decaf what we're doing. Look at this guy. He slept through another briefing. Search and rescue. Biogeneticist Dr. Laura Sorkin. Genetic engineer David Banks. Park veterinarian Jerry Harding and his daughter Jessica Harding. Also, an unidentified woman in need Wait, of medical. Did you a daughter? Yeah, I guess it was feed your daughter to work day or something. Good thing they send me along to rescue her. Giant flesh-eating dinosaurs or Billy Yoder? Yeah, I'm man. I'm not sure which sounds safer. Bravo team, this is Alpha Dog. The word dinosaur being blocked shouldn't be. Center. Over. We're here, where are you? This place is a disaster area. There's I'm not that offended at being called the dinosaur. Just finishing our sweep. Heading to the LZ now. ETA, 10 minutes. Out. Whoa, whoa. Decaf, not so fast. Bum, bum, bum. Uh, message them? I guess. I would assume they just like, but they seem like they buy them in bulk. So I would think they would just have boxes and boxes of these blank canvas converse that they then print onto. I'm guessing they might not be hand painted actually. Maybe they just print onto them. Da, da, da. That tub will be there, but not until I get to see some dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. Right, You've been saying it. Oh, and it's been working. Want to see dinosaurs? I'll get you some coloring books. <laughs> they might be too complicated for Yoder. How about it, Billy? Can you keep in the lines? Listen, hey, this guy looks the just game. like Shepard from Mass That's Effect it. One. That's where you're wrong, Decaf. In the face, in the here, right? Billy Yoder looks like just like he's out of Mass Effect. Hammond wants a pair of dino skin boots bad. We have orders to take down a triceratops and skin it for him before we leave. Oh, I what? Now. I'm actually here to drop you two cavemen off. Makes perfect sense now. Would Hammond really ask for that? Or is that a joke? Oscar, me smell frightened baby in pilot seat. You eat. <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> His man in a box impression. We're not gonna be playing as these guys, are we? These, these, th this, 
they strike me as a little, a little generic. Let's hope they get eaten quick. I feel like we're going to be Billy Yoda. With this guy following us around. What the hell? <laughs> Decaf, keep the engine running. Be ready to get us out of here. Roger. I shouldn't buy any new shoes anyway. Oscar. I actually need to throw some out. Garza. But dinosaurs didn't take him down. It looks like he was shot to death. Stuff that being in lockdown and looking ahead makes you reassess where you're just like, do you know what? I could probably throw out 70% of my clothes and definitely don't need like three or four pairs of shoes, to be honest. Man, those are some serious trank darts. That's one big footprint. Get some spice. Then we can buy more things. Going in. Check out the chopper. Looks like the chopper was shot down trying to take off. Damn, Lenaris. What were you shooting at? Didn't even go for cover. Billy, get up here. Laser beams. I don't know what. Shh. Get away from me, damn it! Get away! What the hell? Vargas. Decaf, we're going in. Watch your ass out there. Watch your six. Trust no one. <laughs> the whole game is just going to be a series of different characters visiting this guys? visitor center. It's not my fault. We couldn't see them. Only their eyes. Come on out now, Vargas. What the hell? Yoda, get back. I'll see if there's another way around. Quit screwing around, Vargas. Get out of the light! They'll see you! Arms. Guns. Little compies. Like when they eat that guy when he goes to the toilet for zapping them. That fa uh, what's his name? Is it Peter Stromer or something? A Swedish actor. Stand down. That's an order. We're sitting ducks here on the beach. We've got to find shelter. What do you think you're doing, Vargas? <laughs> Through the window. Oh. I found some security monitors. I can use the security cams to spot him. Talk to me, Yoder. Where is he? I can't see Vargas. See if you can get him to move. I'll get him. Okay. Fire! Why are we... I need your eyes, Yoder. Why are we shooting this Vargas. guy? I'm so confused. It's too dark. Right side, behind the rock thing. He's freaking out, man. Yoda, where's Vargas? Maybe he got this uh, toxin in him as well. Oh, nice shot. 
Where's my gun? We're under attack. Don't be back. Get away from me, damn it. Oh. What? Who are you? Get away from me. Oscar. Stand down. Holy... What the hell happened to him? Hey, hey, Vargas, look at me! Come on, man, what the hell is wrong with you? They're everywhere, even now, watching us. We gotta... We gotta... Oscar, we gotta find out what happened to Vargas. Get him some help. Forget it. He's lost it. The security office. Maybe there's something on the tapes. Hang in there, Vargas. Hang in there, buddy. There's another security monitor over there. See if you can find anything on the videotapes. We should go. Ah, we can't just leave him like that, man. If we can find out what happened, maybe we can help him. <laughs> I know I recognized Yoda's voice. He's Haku from Spirited Away. But also Max Goof. What's Max Goof? Is that the Goofy movie? All right. Bravo team couldn't have gotten here more than 30 minutes ago. Let's see what we got. <laughs> <laughs> it's the of here. course you recognize that voice. Is this gonna come up again where it's everyone secretly has a crush on Goofy's son? Huh. Well, I guess this camera's been down for a while. Max Goof. Nothing. Hmm. Try the last one. There. See? What is that? Don't know. Take a look at this. Who the hell is that? I'm guessing those are the hardings. So that woman just ran off with our paycheck. Oh, they're looking for us. He's getting munched. We gotta go. Decaf, get that engine started. We're lifting off. I never even watched Goofy. I don't like dog Please, people. Listen to me. Whoever you are, you have to take us back to the visitor center. You have no idea what you're getting into out here. I know my way. I just need you to keep us safe from these... <laughs> Goofy annoys me. Oh, really? How am I supposed to do that? Electric fences are down. Dinosaurs have free run of the island. None of us are safe here. Do you understand that? This is InGen Rescue Team Alpha trying to reach Dr. Jerry Harding. Obviously, the visitor center was compromised. If you're still out there, we're trying to... Dad, if there's a rescue team coming, maybe we should try to leave a trail for them or something. Jess, that's enough. If we want to keep out of the way of dangerous predators, I'm going to need to know where we're headed. Norte. North? To the coast? What for? Don't worry about it. We're back with the gang. Ugh. Oh, need some help. You're hurt. Yeah. Let me help you. Don't help me! We're going to rest here for a minute. If we're stopping, I'll need to make a fire. Mm, It'll like keep the dinosaurs away. Fine. Stay where I can see you. Mm. Hopefully nothing happens whilst I'm trying to fix. Siéntate. Is there anything I, I can do? Them too much Stay and they close. Out of the leather. Headphone fixing ASMR. It's actually so weird hearing my own voice without headphones on. I'm so used to the slightly muffled sound of it that actually talking to you guys right now with my headphones off is bizarre. Uh, what have I done here? You know, I think I actually broke them. Hmm. 
Oh, hang on, that's it. Oh, I have. Oh no, the clip. It's come apart. I mean, they still work. I've just, like, pulled them out too much, I think. Me old big noggin. Me old big head there. I thought I heard something break when I was doing it the other day. It's when I had this. Because I went through this period of migraines. I was trying to make it so that my headset wasn't squeezing at all. Oh, it's annoying. These are so expensive as well. They're, like, the first nice pair of headphones I've ever owned. And I've broken them. But hopefully they don't break any more than this. I'll just have to be careful with them. Maybe put some tape on them. I can't make the left side any smaller now, but that's okay. I don't really need it to be like that anyway. Oh, I love these headphones. Dad, there are some fresh dino tracks here. They're small, like a chicken's. Uh, it's likely Compsognathus. I saw lots of them while we were walking. It's relatively harmless. It's nothing to worry about. Bum, 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 bum. How old are they? My headphones? Uh, I think I bought them less than a year ago. Hey, Dad. Off are Amazon, these so edible? Probably not. It's best to steer clear of anything we find out here. That's a weird looking plant. Hey, don't wander off. It was too, uh, oh, too, so too rough with them, the I guess, whilst could airlift in some pizza. extending them. Hey, Dad, there's Edge. some eggs over here. Any chance they could be dino eggs? Eggs? No. Remember, all the dinosaurs on the island are female? Still, just leave them alone. We have enough problems without an angry mama bird or lizard to deal with. The quality on these headphones is amazing, though. Absolutely the best pair I've ever owned. Back off some, okay? Are you sure you're okay? That bite looked pretty bad. Normally I work with animals, but I am very well trained in first aid. I I'd like to go ahead and take a look at your wound again, if you'll let me. <sighs> I'm fine. Look, you're gonna need it cleaned and dressed again to avoid infection. If you bring us back to the visitor center, I can get a hold of some antibiotics for you. You, girl! Yeah? Some of these trees have fruits that look like tiny blueberries. Bring some to me. Uh, okay. It's Jess, by the way. Like, she what? knows this island. Uh, Jess. My name's Jess. Okay, Jess. Bring me the berries. They're good medicine. She knows what plants grow here. Are these the right berries? No, the ones I need are darker. Are these the berries you need? See, si. bring them here. We're losing daylight. Come on, girl. I need those berries. Here. Uh. So demanding. Nima. Gracias. Um, de nada. She's a good kid. I know. Hmm. <laughs> she did the thing that I shouted at her to do. She's a good kid. I know. Are these berries edible? I'm hungry. That plant is poisonous. A handful of those berries is enough to kill a grown man. Oh, they look delicious. Maybe just a couple wouldn't hurt me. Jess. <laughs> it's like, it's like, get it, you dumb. I'm so what? Just call them compies. It's easier. Hmm. So why is it you don't want to go with the rescue team? Are you like one of those radical environmentalists or something? 
Does Injun have like a file on you? They don't bother keeping files on people like me. Heck was that sound? Calfee. The heck? To go towards new headphones or a new chair. <laughs> or a carpet clean from all the chair oil. Or pancakes. Aw, thank you so much, Calfee, coming in with some very, very generous support. Can we get a lot of love and hype in the chat? New headphones, new chair, definitely new chair. That's happening. I think I'm gonna order that this week. IKEA is closed, so I'm just gonna order it for delivery. Hopefully it comes soon. Hopefully I don't end up needing new headphones, but that will definitely go towards the new chair. Thank you so, so much. That's very, very kind. Very, very sweet. Very, very generous. Appreciate you. Thank you so much. Spam that love. You're kind of quiet, Dad. Yeah. Pick on him, why don't you? Don't be stupid. Yoink the gun. Man, it's like now that I know they're kind of broken, I can't stop touching it. I need to leave them alone. I'll put some tape on there later. Thank you so, so much. I really, really appreciate that. Let's see, what do we have? Look, before we go any further, I want to know why you're here and what you plan to do with us. You'll be okay if you do what I tell you. Do you have any family? None of your business. I just thought that if you could understand how- You love your daughter, don't you? Uh, yes, of, of course. You'd do anything to make sure she grows up safe. Yeah, I would. Good. Then I know you'll do exactly as I say. And as long as you do that, I won't shoot her. I can tell by the way you talk to Jess. You, you have a daughter, don't you? Stop talking. Think of her. And you'll understand what I I'm... said. Shut up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I. You Mwah. know nothing about me. We are not simpatico, comprende? You say another word, and I will shoot you and leave you for the scavengers. Please, just calm down. Cal I didn't mean anything by it. Just shut up. Okay. Okay. Whoa. I won't. I promise. I will, don't hurt us. Just don't hurt us. Hmm. Look, about your daughter. Go ahead. Keep asking. Okay, all right. You're you're right. I just I shouldn't have said anything. So wait, okay? I can I'm push the buttons and she stands up. Maybe then if we switch. You don't need to understand. You just keep doing as I say, I everything will be fine. Okay, well, she's okay, I will. I just, I will just relax. We're all okay here, right? Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Dude, how I won't blind mention is she? It again. How blind Please. is she? Are you like a mercenary? Hey, um, I, I drank like four diet sodas earlier and I really have to pee like super bad. Go, hurry. <laughs> Hello? Can hmm. anyone hear me? Please identify yourself. Over. Hey, hi. Um, this is Jessica Harding. Me and my dad were supposed to have been rescued. But there's this woman with a gun. I, I think she's taking us up Not north. even whispering. Okay, can you describe your location? Any buildings, roads, landmarks? Uh, landmarks. Uh, no, not really. Just regular jungle crap, like trees and dirt and stuff. Everything looks the same out here. Oh, but my dad built a fire? You might be able to see the smoke Ooh, if- Yo, what do you busted. think you're doing? Um, I'm just calling my boyfriend? <laughs> Stupido! Please, this is my fault. I don't want to kill you, but I will do it in a heartbeat if I have to, comprende? What I have to lose is too important. Let's go. We're getting out of here. We saved your life. Oh, but my dad built a fire. You might be able to see the smoke. Hello? What happened? Is that them? Is that the Hardings? Yeah, it was the girl. It didn't sound good down there. Girls said they were headed north. Let's head that way and see what we can find. I don't know, Yoder. Maybe that girl was in shock, you know? I read a study you once that said... Do me a favor and stop talking. Just head north. Hang on to your butts. This is it. See anything, Oscar? Looks familiar. 
How's that exactly? Before your time. Hmm. No sign of them there. Curious where this ends up going, all of this. Did that girl say anything to you about a cliff? No. But she did say they were going north. They could have been heading for the coast. Look for the fire. Signs of a fire. No sign of them. Just trees. Oh, look, smoke. We got smoke. Smoke? Think they're trying to signal us? I thought we were dealing with a hostage situation. What was that? Bird headed this way. Or the chopper? Why the hell would they do that? Hang on. Snooze. Ah. Easy now. Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna have to take over for a while. How about that? So loud all of a sudden. Barely hear him over the music. Oh, steady. That'll do it for our flight. We know you have a great the audio is just everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. And we thank you for choosing Yoder Airways. It's so weird how audio mixing gets neglected in games and movies as well like the amount of stuff that you watch where it's oh man you can't hear dialogue and then the action is really loud when they get it's also lazy and yeah, then they should have gotten pterodactyl insurance Pteranodon insurance huh can you fix it uh yeah give me about a month you've got an hour there's duct tape in the survival kit These jungles seem different. Different from what? All jungles kind of look the same to me. Hey, you remember the... Hey, hold on. That hurts. <laughs> hey, man, I'm just a two-dimensional soldier character. Maybe. But we're still pretty far away from where you spotted the fire. Just another, another jungle Whatever to me, was, baby. It's now. Let's move out. I smell smoke. Check it out. They're close. Come on. Hold up. It may not be safe. I know. That's what I have this for. <laughs> that run out of nowhere. <laughs> he's now he's not running. That was so random. Oscar, definitely signs of camp. That's what I got this for. <laughs> Just need to pick up their trail. Mm -mm. Ford versus Ferrari, that's a great film. That's the one with Christian Bale and uh Matt Damon, yeah? I'm not even into cars, I and I really here. liked that film. This just keeps getting better. Like, I know nothing about cars or racing. No broken leaves, stems. If they came this way, they didn't leave a trace. That way. We've got some fresh tracks here, Oscar. I'm guessing dinos. Oh boy. I'll bet that's not gonna go over well with mom. Huh. Go. Dude, where's the other guy? So slow. Ah, ah. Oh, you okay? 
Oscar, thank God. I thought I was a goner. Oh, nice. I told you to be careful. What the hell is that thing, anyway? Whatever it is, I'm gonna kill it. Oh, well, calm down, big guy. It's over. It's over. Let it go. Look at it. You won. It's not gonna hurt anyone now. Hey, thanks. Anyway, I looked everywhere. Couldn't find any sign of a trail. That way. You realize we're headed straight towards a cliff, don't you? It's definitely gonna eat There's someone. There's no way down from here. We're gonna have to find another way around, which will take us, I don't know, at least a half a day. There's an old goat path that will take us down. Goat. The what bone the? shaker. Oh, wow. How can you tell me about any rides like this, Dad? <gasps> Are we going to ride the... Oh, my God. We're so going to ride the roller coaster. I did tell you that there'd be a lot more for you to see next time you visited. These rides aren't even online yet. That path was ancient. Carved into the stone. It survived storms, earthquakes. She does know the island, it's, then. That's why she's mad. Late to go Good luck with your appointment, Calfi. Thank you so much again came. for that support. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Contact Happy the Pancake rescue Day. Team. It is our best chance of survival. Down there. We can ride this contraption to yes, get us down to that Yes, he's ready exit. to ride a roller coaster. We're going to ride it? That lever. It looks like it would set the tracks to stop at that exit. Yes, but that's the emergency lever. Besides, it's obviously not ready for Has anyone to been on the well, Jurassic Park like ride at Universal? It wasn't built when You'll I went there, but... Safe way down, or Does I'll it exist anymore? Down. If I Maybe it's been so long on, that it doesn't exist anymore. I might anymore, be able but... to set the, the ride to maintenance mode from up here. What's maintenance mode? It'll switch the tracks, same as the emergency lever. Basically, it lets the employees use the tracks for work and repairs instead of for fun. But I don't see any cars on the main track, Dad. Get the power on. We're still going? Yeah, it's getting dark. We cannot go back the way we came, and it sounds like the dinosaurs are getting ready to hunt. Are they hunting us? Well, they're still a good ways off, but we shouldn't stick around here for long. Listen. If we're going to make it to the coast, we are going to have to work together to make it there alive. Understood? Ben's having you, a munch. Come with me. Oh, you we're went on it in Japan. That's cool. I just saw a video yesterday of the uh, Nintendo World that just opened up there. There. Stand I think it's... The lever. Is it in You're Disneyland? The, cars on the, track. the Nintendo World? Or is it in Universal? Something. Hey, Dad. Looks what are these cool, cars though. for? They don't have any seats. My guess is those are utility carts. We gotta get him off the track and load in some cars we can actually sit in. Hmm. Oh, here's a nice little theme in the background. Move the scaffolding. How am I supposed to do that? It's like way too heavy. Na na na. Na na na. That's how they pick cars. Push some buttons. Get the cars onto the track in the right order. Fit up to four cars on the track at once. So don't we want to, like, take these other ones off right now? Um, okay, so, like, attach this other one here. Hang on. Can I make that go back? Let's go! We need that scaffolding off the track! Yeah, uh, I don't think it's going anywhere unless you're way stronger than you look. Just push it! I can't. You push it. Push. Uh, father? Okay, these, these are the main controls for the roller coaster. I should be able to set it to maintenance mode from here. Huh. What are we missing here? So, to get the ride started, we need three cars on the loading track in the right order. You stay there. Your daughter and I will get the cars back on the rails. Okay. Power's still out. You can't go any further until we get it back on. Judging by the layout of this place, 
I'd say the power station must be over in that area. Stay there. You go. Okay, so, like, what am I looking for? Power station. Look for doors. <laughs> power station. Random old bits of wood. Hmm. Nothing here. There is clearly something there. Is this the power thingy? That looks like it. Open them up and throw the main switch. The doors are locked. Well, I don't have a key. That's cool. I'll just bust the windows. He's like, what do you want me to do about it? This should get me into those doors. Rebel. What if you failed it though? Shoot. <laughs> this should get me into those doors. Oh, did it change? Shoot. Just a disappointment, such a disappointment. This should get me into those doors. Okay, what do you got? What do you got? What do you got? Oh, in time. Oh. Okay, well, this is just embarrassing now. Shoot. All right, hang on. This should get me into those doors. And go. What? Shoot. When do you want me to do it? Listen, I swear, I'm good at quick time events. I got everyone through until dawn, until the very end. This should get me into those doors. It's these controls. Right, when does it want me to do it? When it's on the circle? Oh. Awesome. Now do it. Okay, I, I can reach inside, but what am I looking for? Jess, there are two large switches inside, but you probably won't be able to reach them like that. What? Why not? What else is here? Gotta get past these doors somehow. Right. So I don't. Why? Why can't you just open it from the inside now? Where else is there? We've been everywhere. Hey, looks like the crane is functional. Good. Now do something useful with it. Man. Oh, there you go. Do we have to get out to hook it on? Hello. Jess, be careful. What are you doing with that hook? I've got a plan. You're gonna love this. Okay, Dad, your turn. Everyone <laughs> get back. Just awesome. pulls it out of the ground entirely, just electrocutes the kid. What's the grid override? Hey, okay, that's one. Twitch being weird? What happened? Looks like we have power. Whoa, cool. Okay, and come on back. What's that? I don't know. Well, who's it gonna be? They're still too far away for me to tell which ones, thank goodness. Not a T-Rex though, right? Definitely not a T-Rex. <laughs> Hug. I have no idea how bits work, but hope this helps with the chair slash headphones. Ah, Shipping, maybe? That's how they work. Thank you so much for the 1,000 biddies. Can we get some hype and love in the chat for the support? 1,000 biddies from Hug the Lug. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. I reckon we now use the crane on the... 
cards, right? It froze and was replaying the same 30 seconds. That's weird. That's weird. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, so we want that one on the front, right? How do we... Let's see what he says if we... Aha, uh -huh, so... She needs to get that one out of the way, doesn't she? I think. Hey, what about this? Can you use it for anything? How should I know? Use it to go shark fishing if you think it'll help. Huh? We could do something with this, right? Maybe hook it onto the loading track. But what if we damage the track? Then there's no way down. Put it on the thing. We could do something with this, right? Attach it to the scaffolding. We can use the crane to lift it off the tracks. Stand back, Jess. Oops, that's not good. Okay, so then... I can't fit any more cars on the track. I'll have to move some off first. Good, 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 good. That's what we want, and then you turn these around. That gives us space to put this on. No, I want it off. Aha, it works! Okay, that's pretty cool, actually. Off. Can't have any more cars in the track. I'll have to move some off first. Oh, it's the other direction, is it? Okay, put two in there. One in here. We're puzzling. <laughs> Reminds me of the, uh, there was a puzzle like this in that recent Spider-Man, Miles Morales. With moving the trains around. That should do it. They're in the wrong order, though. I wonder if that matters. Does it matter? Two is at the back, so... I'm guessing it matters if she's... Annoyed. Like, not... It's not happening, right? Hang on, let me switch. Let me switch. Go one, two, three, of course. What did you guys have for dinner today? I had a vegetable bake and uh, a pizza because I just threw some stuff in the oven. Whilst I was getting that video out. It was pretty nice. Uh, that one back. I actually totally forgot that I ordered groceries and my doorbell went and I was still in bed watching TikTok. I was like, oh. <laughs> Quickly jump out of bed. It's like, damn, I totally forgot that I did that. Uh, now I need a space somehow. There's no open slot to move the car into. I think with Amazon they would just leave it, but unless you're getting some alcohol or pills or something. Having crab legs tonight, nice. Uh, how can I? I need some space somewhere. Move this one off. Ba -dum -bum -bum. Burger and some chili was delicious, nice. Cheese and crackers, can't beat that. Chicken and corito soup, beautiful. Ordering pancakes. Delivered pancakes, nice. There's no open slot to move the car into. Depending on when we finish this, I might make some pancakes today. Okay, so then if I have a space. Let me get that three out the way.
Oops. Uh, actually, what I want to do is get the two. Rice and Japanese curry sounds delicious. Bow tie pasta. What's everyone? Everyone's favorite shape of pasta. I love. Um, I love like normal. I guess like spaghetti, like long spaghetti. And then of the shapes, I love the tubes. Now they rarely have them, but I love those. Uh, what am I doing here? Okay, make this. Uh, I felt like I had it, and then why did I, why did I distract myself? I want the two in front of there, and I want the three behind it. Right? But I need to get that one out of the way. In the front. Angel hair, which is apparently controversial. Angel hair, angel hair. What's, uh, which one is angel hair? Okay, so two's ready to go. So let me just get that one out of the way. Do I have a space? I do have a space. Nice. I think the one I've been getting recently actually is uh, Linguini. I don't know if that's a type or... Slot to move the car into. Yeah, move it forward, please. Hey, we did it. Yeah, I love pasta so much. Any pasta is great, and then just think that's right. So hey, much cheese. The cars are all on the loading track. Tomato pasta, now absolutely like nine times out of ten. But I love a creamy that. pasta too. What? I mean, they probably heard that noise. Let's. Not worry about the rescue team right now. All right, now we get Dad to power it on. Over here. Roller coaster of love. Well, that ought to do it. The ride should stop and let us out at the maintenance exit. Definitely Instead something's going to have a little loop. nibble at us whilst we're on this. Whoa. Well, that's it. Since the ride is in maintenance mode, it should be safe. It won't go very fast. Come on. The sooner we get to the coast, the sooner this will all be over. Hang on. This is going to be a short trip. Will this thing go any faster? Uh, yeah. It's too real. <laughs> oh man, I need to turn the music down. I feel like it's turned itself up on this episode. That was hilarious. Oh look, it's a different dinosaur for each episode. That's cool. The music is turned down. Why is it so loud? Oh! Bonk! Whoa! I mean, let's see what happens. <laughs> Just... Oh, it's reset our death count. Nah. Let it happen. Here it comes. 
Disappointed Dad Tuesday. Oops. I like how it doesn't show it in, like, I mean, pretending it didn't show us the T-Rex eating her in the last episode. Like, straight munched up. I pushed it, game. Uh. Bonk. Oof. What does it want me to do? Tap it? Look out! What dinosaur is this? Oh, snap. Oh yeah, forgot that you had a gun. What are we doing here? I'm fending them off with a pipe. <laughs> Come on, we just need the kid to bump her head now. We need the hat trick. Oh. Oh. Oh, why did I duck? I realized at the last second what it was. Let's go upstairs. It just straight up pulled the music then. Get out now. I mean, what if we don't though? I did it tw Okay, do you know what? I didn't realize I was going to get another shot at that one. Munch, munch, munch. Does it anyway Let's without me? It's okay, sweetheart. We're safe now. So scary. Oops. Don't let me go, Gabe. Don't let me go. I got you. Well, where'd you come from? Thank you. You. <laughs> Get that out of my face. What now? Now, we go for a little ride. Please, don't say ride. So what did this you call those hilarious. things that were chasing you? Harry Sauruses? Herrerasaurus from the Triassic era. Now that we've bred them, we can easily classify them as early theropod. Oh, yeah, early theropod. That's exactly what I've been saying all these years. Right, Oscar? Where's Denny? Mm -mm. What happened? Decaf! You take the chopper. I'll check the perimeter. Stay put.
So I guess these are mercs it's sent back by money. Ingen, right? Because he made a comment why. about Hammond wanting some boots sent to rescue whoever was left behind, I guess. Boy, your pilot's a real slob. Keep your mouth shut. Don't even think about it. Danny's, and it's jammed. Jam. His helmet. Oscar! I don't like what's going on here, man. Decaf's gun's jammed, there's a blood trail over there, and he never leaves his helmet on the ground. Never. Decaf is MIA. MIA. MIA? No way, man. He was supposed to stay with the chopper. He's gotta be around here somewhere. Billy, you feel that? We've already lost Bravo team and, 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 and... Billy! Look, we are not leaving without decaf. I mean, we agreed, right? Oh, man, I will not let you turn this into Nicaragua all over again. At ease! We've got a situation here. Inside the chopper, now. We want to come too. Take us to the mainland. Oscar, I've got no power. I'm on it. Ah, we're this guy now. I wonder if the Rex is gonna chomp this. Not responding. Try another one. Oh, for God's sake. Did, did you see that, Oscar? I don't like when that happens. Pick up the pace. I can pop that one out. Second time. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> He's careful, little now. thumb presses. Woo! We got power! Here he comes! This reminds me I had a T-Rex toy, actually. That thing was so cool. When you stomped it, it made the stomping sound. And you put it down. And you could squeeze its tummy and it roared. Oh, that'd be so crazy to see. Get away from it. Well, now what's going to happen if we're in a helicopter? Isn't there like three episodes left? You're a good little thief. Are we going to crash? Handcuffs? She's going to make us crash a bit. So who's left? Dr. Sorkin and her assistant. Ah, uh, more pickups. Get the hell out of here. What about decaf? Decaf's dead. I like your tattoos. Why don't you tell her what your tattoos mean? What do they mean? Gravestones are for the people who die beside him. The skulls are for the people who die because of him. Tell us, where are you gonna put decaf's tombstone? You running out of room. What did you say? Hey, come on. It's been a long day and everyone's just a little tense. Let's keep it together, guys. I'm not afraid of you two. Me? Yeah, well, I'm more of a lover than a fighter. But Oscar... <laughs> you know, I've seen Oscar knock out someone's teeth for a lot less. When I say teeth, I mean face. Don't be fooled. You're in the company of killers. Are you saying no knock out someone's face? Company of killers. 
Oh, that's got a nice ring to it. Uh, it could be a hit single. Yeah, you're in the company of killers. Yeah! You need further proof that these men are crazy? This is what they do. They hurt people, and then they joke about it. Speaking of jokes, Oscar, tell the one about the priest, the stripper, and the bucket of frogs. <laughs> Pay attention! This is how men act when they lack the courage to face themselves. No, I like to look at myself. I mean, check out this gorgeous face. What is oh, happening I'm right now? I'm surprised you can see it all with your head stuck up your... That's enough! Oh, boy. What are you gonna do, kill me? You did that to me once already. You're crazy! I'm thinking of getting a butterfly tattoo. On my I'm ankle. gonna carve the names of the people you killed into those skulls of yours. Riot. Then we'll see hey. how proud you Listen, are. Listen, there's still more people who need our help. Whatever your issues are, you can work them out when we get to the mainland. And no, you cannot get a tattoo. <laughs> so random. I feel like butterfly. Uh, I feel like ankle ones would hurt. Right? Oh, thank goodness Isn't it you're sensitive safe. down there? After we lost contact, I was worried something had happened to you. We have had quite a day, Dr. Sorkin. I'll bet. Systems are down all over the damn park. Dinosaurs are running free. Ugh. Bring the kids. Fun for all. Hey, don't worry, kid. We're fairly geographically cut off from the rest of the island Waterfall. out here. Nothing but herbivores. This guy that was on the first date's Valentine's What's one was covered on in here? tattoos. Like, full there neck tattoo as well. Complications. And he had shaved the sides Who of his head, and he had that all tattooed as well. He said that was the most painful one, the side of the head. Which is like, yeah, I can imagine. So instead of hair on the side of his head, he had tattoos. Of, like, sort of symbols and stuff, I guess. Very, like, intricate. Uh, yeah, we're the band. Uh, where can we set up? Excuse me? I'm just kidding. InGen sent us. We're the cavalry come to the rescue. I'm Billy Yoder. This is Look, let's just get this out of the way. I'm not going anywhere. This part of the island is pretty remote and is a long way from the predators. I'm perfectly safe and I don't need saving. That's not a good idea, ma'am. But, since you're here, what you can do is start loading the stacks of bureaucratic this is mystery paperwork knows. that's taking up valuable space. They were supposed to have sent for that stuff months ago. Listen, lady, we don't have time for this. You either get in the helicopter peacefully, or I will personally knock you out, put you in cuffs, and throw you in! You lay one hand on me, and I will have you so ass-deep in litigation that you'll be reading legal text for a decade. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, you know what? If it'll help us get off this island faster, we'll move your boxes. Where are they? Uh, over there, at the loading dock. You heard the lady. Hey, can I help? Uh, mm, journal unlock. Uh, what, help move boxes with these two killers? No. Sorry, hon. This ain't a job for little girls. Look how skinny you are, anyhow. Don't you drink milk? Oh, I thought you guys were a rescue team. But I guess you're just here for manual labor. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. We're highly trained Hey, Dad, why are you letting your kid go off with these guys? Do they teach you to lift with your legs in mercenary school? Or do you bring a dolly with you on rescue missions? Ah, <laughs> oh, you're a smart-ass kid, aren't you? I also like football and hate shopping, but I still can't find a boyfriend. <laughs> oh, boy. Are you serious? What? I'm taking a break. I think she has Good a crush idea. on old Don't Billy Yoda. Yourself. So what's the deal? Why didn't you tell Dr. Sarkin why it's so important to get off this island? Trust me, if we bully that one, she's gonna cause problems. So what do we do? Simple. Charmer. Look, all I need to do is get some information on this woman. Dig into her past. Find out what makes her tick. I'm sure if I say enough of the right things, she'll practically think getting off the island was her idea in the first place. Hey, can I bum one of those? Okay. She's a rebel. Ugh, smells like a barrel of wet dog hair. I know, right? I don't get why dinosaurs eat that stuff. So, who feels like carrying these boxes back to the helicopter? Me neither. 
I'm not moving these things. They look like they weigh a ton. I think Dr. Sorkin said we're only supposed to move file boxes. Oh, yeah. Well, good. Ba, 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 ba. Anything here? Oh, dialogue. Hmm. Hey, Oscar. Was there any dirt on Dr. Sorkin in the mission briefing? If I'm gonna have to use the old Yoda charm, I'll need some intel. Big time protester in the 70s, lots of animal rights crap. Handful of arrests for it. All of her engine related history is classified. Said to expect her to be a pain in the ass. It said that? Between the lines. Are you gonna do any work around here? What are we, union now? <laughs> <laughs> How the hell does Dr. Sorkin think we're gonna load all this crap into the chopper? Don't know, but you better do it if you want to get on a good side. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, thanks. You so what happened to your teeth, then? If you want to tag along with us, that's cool. Just give Oscar his space. He doesn't do very good with kids. Or adults, or animals. Come to think of it, he doesn't do very good with anybody. Just stay out of his way. I'm kind of surprised your dad let us come over here, to be honest. I mean, he's threatened to, like, knock out two women just in the short time that you've been with us, but, you know. So, Sorkin. Hippie type. Got arrested a bunch protesting for animal rights. So, Sorkin. Hippie type. Got arrested... Oh, whoopsie. Yes, 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 go back. ...did a bunch protesting for animal rights. How do I get out of here? There we go. Wait here. I'm gonna go talk to Sorkin. Uh, what should I do? You wanna help? See if you can dig up anything interesting on our friend Dr. Sorkin in those file boxes. Cool. I can't tell you how many times I tried convincing him. The park should be a nature preserve. No theme park attractions, no cages. Hammond never really cared about the marvels I created for him. It's always been about the money. If I took a look at your wound, yeah, mm -hmm. why not? I've tried talking to her, Doctor Sorkin. Hey, you know who our prisoner is? Because no one else seems to. Well, I've never seen her on the island before. I don't recognize her as someone who works for Ingen, but I don't know everyone, so it's possible. Okay. Hey, Doc, you got a pharmacy inside? It's gonna be a long flight back if we don't get this prisoner either elated or sedated. She seems harmless enough now, and she's adequately secured. Are you afraid she's gonna beat you up? Well, I do have a history of women wanting to get their hands on me. Where? Well. I hate to interrupt, ma'am, but I really think we need to be going. I'm afraid I can't, Mr. Yoder. Someone needs to tend to the dinosaurs during this disaster. I'm sorry, Dr. Sorkin, but InGen wants all survivors back on the mainland as soon as possible. No exceptions. Why can't it wait? I feel like he's meant to be kind of like the charismatic wild card, right? Billy Yoda. With the stuff that he's saying. But it's kind of so orc. Someone needs to speak to the board about protecting these dinosaurs. You believe in animal rights, don't you? Wouldn't you put your neck on the line for them? Huh. You have a point. But as long as John Hammond is in charge, the animals are going to need me here to ensure that they're treated with respect. Okay. Is there anything I can say to convince you to come with us? If there is, you haven't said it yet. Do we know who this woman is? Like, does she appear in, a, in 3 or something? I'm not... I don't recall who this is. the outside world's gonna think of all this. The government of Costa Rica will certainly have to think twice about InGen's presence here. Mm-hmm. Maybe Works when it came out seems a bit outdated now. Yeah, that's kind of my thinking with it, is how different it feels, I guess. I mean, it is 10 years old. Trust me, I know. You know, Doc, I saw some bites like that on one of my men back at the visitor center. Mr. Call me Billy. Mr. Yoder, would you please tend to the InGen files like we discussed? Yes, ma'am. It's interesting. You know, if you're in some kind of trouble with InGen... Let's see what they got back here. So, what'd you find out? Looks like Dr. Sorkin wanted to turn this place into a dinosaur preserve instead of an amusement park. He's a wise guy. Why would they? There's no money in that. So Dr. Sorkin has a weakness for preserving wildlife. Good to know. Okay, I guess we go 
talk to her about that. I mean, what was Hammond thinking? The man continually ignored the warnings of his own scientists over marketing people, shareholders, everyone. A disaster like her shirt. Like was inevitable. Decide. What about our patient? I'm fine. I tried to convince her to go with the rescue team, but Dr. Sorkin. As I told you, I'm staying behind to watch after the animals. All right, well, we can leave then. We really need to get you out of here. Why? Mm, the preserve. Wouldn't this place be better off as some kind of dinosaur preserve? I mean. It's kind of stupid to treat these creatures like they're in some kind of circus, right? Well, obviously that's true. But as long as John Hammond is in charge, the animals are going to need me here to ensure that they're treated with Come respect. Come on, Sorkin. I want to see what the next thing is. Look, Dr. Sorkin. We already caught one unauthorized trespasser. Who knows who else is on the island? Your life may be in danger. I'll take my chances, thank you. Trust me, there is a very good reason. Well, come back when you think of one. I'm interested in hearing You're being about silly. Things. Well, like a... How's your smoke? Lengthy. Oh, that's a lot of rejected dino preserve proposals. Yep. I gotta hand it to the lady. She don't give up easy. So, Sorkin. Hippie type. Got arrested That's all we have. protesting for animal rights. Hmm. Nothing else here. Okay, keep trying then. Do you know, he actually told me it doesn't matter that we have dinosaurs from the Jurassic and Triassic ages living together. As long as it's exciting. Moron. So that girl is your daughter. They're really, uh... Just making a thing of destroying Hammond's legacy in this game. Her mother? Remarried. It's Dr. Sorkin. Why do you think interrupting me is going to work this time? Listen, Hammond really made a mess of this place. You have no idea. There's no hiding his incompetence after this disaster. You're absolutely right, Mr. Yoder. But none of this matters if the board of directors... I'm not supposed to say this, but I heard the board is going to hold an emergency meeting about, you know, new leadership. You could be there. You were there. You could be the They'd boss. Act as a witness to the events that took place here. They'd have to listen to you. That's true. I hate to admit it, Mr. Yoder, but perhaps you're right. And our orders also mention an assistant, David. Yes, I'm afraid David won't be coming back with us. He told him to stay away from the quarantine. Oh, Doctor Sorkin, I'm, I'm so sorry. Thank you. Now, before we go, I have some work in the lab She's like, that must be completed me. first. Dr. Harding, perhaps you and your daughter would like to assist me. I've been working on a cure for one of our dinosaurs' nastier genetic disorders. Oh? Which one? It's dietary. Right up your alley. Dr. Harding, we've done it. And what exactly have we done? Reverse the lysine contingency, of course. Ah, oh, the that? lysine contingency. Yes. Henry Wu that makes added perfect. a gene to the dinosaurs that, that makes them dependent on supplements of an amino acid called lysine. Without their weekly doses, they'll all die off. You cannot give that to the dinosaurs. They need to be contained. If any of them get off the island... Okay, listen. I've been working with the Parasaurs Behavioral Program for months now. If I go back to the mainland to fight for this place, they'll all be dead before I can get back. Along with all of my research. Parasaurs? Parasaurolophus. They're herbivores, generally safe. Let me give the solution to them to see if it even works. Why? How many Leave. are we talking about? Why don't you come out with me? See how much progress we've made with them. Can we, Dad? Fine. Oh my we'll go. god. Cool. Fine. Cool. Of course. We nearly died three times I'm today. Let's go to for a walk. I finally have you out here, Dr. Harding, despite the circumstances. We've been doing some very interesting work with our parasaurs. Behavioral communication experiments. You've interpreted their calls. Some of them. And I plan to use that to get them out of the pen. Out? Well, I'm not going to treat their water with them still in there. How do we know there aren't any bad dinosaurs around? Well, believe it or not, the dinosaurs told me. Oh, she's crazy. So Let's one, leave. She's the lookout. Let's She'll leave. Time to go. Wrap it up. The others graze. <laughs> Let's go. Any predators Get out of in the vicinity, here. 
she'd be nervous and emitting a danger call. But she's not. She's calm. Jerry, you can activate the speakers from there. Jess and I will set the various parasaur sounds that play through them. Dad, it's okay. I mean, it's safe, right? The parasaurs will warn us of trouble before it gets close. Stay with Dr. Sorkin. Listen, dear, I'm putting your fire, your life and my life into the hands of a beast that's been uh, extinct for millions of years. Don't worry, darling. So you can really speak dinosaur? We've been doing behavioral tests using various parasaur calls, playing them through the speakers around the pen. We can't just shoo the animals out, but we should be able to manipulate them into moving using their own sounds. Cool. This feels like These they really the the needed something to, to draw the game out. I was really enjoying all of the action and the escaping, and the on the now I'm just like, why are we so chill and just... Dinosaur. What about the big set of speakers in the middle of the pen? Ah. Those emit the danger call. The parasaurs will instinctively move away from Random it. So dinosaur can puzzle. Herd dinosaurs out of this pen using the speakers and their sounds. Dude, that one is so wall. That parasaur lifts. How do I turn on the speakers? I'll have to tell your dad to do it when we're ready. Mm -hmm. Dr. Harding? Yeah? I need you to activate the east side speakers, please. East side, okay. So you want them to leave? Is that the thing? No. Don't. Understand. Bum 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 bum. Have a good evening hug. East. <laughs> What's this button do? What is what does that communicate to the parasaurs, miss? Well we need to evacuate them out of there and If we want to move the dinosaurs forward, we might need to give them a good scare from behind. I think you oh, already we did. Can use the danger call. Good thinking. Um, thank you so much for a ghostly poop. Thank you so much, an anonymous 444. I appreciate it. Thank you for the support. Wait, how do I go back over to Dad to do the other speakers? <laughs> Wait, what? Jerry. Dr. Harding? Yeah? Mm, danger. Activate the danger speakers. There we go. Wait, now they... what? What? How come that one never moved? That one stands guard to make sure all the others are safe. Even when there's a danger call? The lookout's the one that makes the danger call. When there are predators around, she'll stand her ground, drawing attention away from the other dinos. Okay... Need a quick reminder about how the speakers work? Yes, please. These speakers on the west side of the pen can be set to play a parasaur food call that will attract the hungry dinos. The speakers on the east control the mating sounds that will attract the more, uh, amorous dinosaur. 
The big speakers in the center emit a danger call that will scare the dinos away from it. She said that like it just absolutely disgusts her that anyone's interested in love or lust or anything. The, uh, amorous. <laughs> uh, okay, so do the west speakers. Dr. Harding? Yeah? West side speakers, please. Don't take this the wrong way, but isn't this kind of pointless? Yes. They're just going to be eaten anyway, right? Some will, yes. But others will adapt, find places to inhabit, mate, and carry on the species. A much better fate than being massacred in this pen. But they can't mate. Dad said the dinosaurs on the island are all girls. Well... You can never be 100% sure about something like that. Okay, so I moved them. I, I don't know what I'm doing. Try that. Dr. Harding? Yeah? West side speakers, please. <laughs> So the hungry ones come over here. That one is still over there. So I heard you were like a hippie protester or something in the 70s. At the mating Where'd you speaker. Hear that? From Yoder. The 70s were a tumultuous time. I fought for what I believed in. And sometimes it gets you arrested. You were arrested? And you still got a job as a, you know, scientist? Paleogeneticist. And yes, youth is the time to be reckless and test your boundaries. It's how you learn what's important to you. Yeah, I'm a thief. What? I'm gonna date that mercenary as well. Wait, isn't he like 38? <laughs> yeah, reckless. A scientist told me to. I feel like this is becoming less Jurassic Park and just this terrible father just completely losing his daughter. This is how his daughter goes off the rails like that roller coaster through the process of this game. Okay, so if I move them over there, now if we do the east mating speaker, maybe we get that one over there too. Dr. Harding? Yeah? East side speakers again. Hey. Hello. I'm ready. And then maybe so, if we do danger, they leave. what happened to your assistant? Let's not talk about that right now. Well, did you work with him long? I, said, I didn't want to talk about it, child. Listen, he was a wonderful young man. And I am sad. I really am. But if I let that stop my work, so disrespectful. then all these animals will die too, trapped behind the walls that we built. You understand? Your assistant that just died. I don't want to talk about it. Did you love him? I said. Dr. Harding? Yeah? Activate the danger speakers. <laughs> That's it. They're out. Good job, Jess. Finally. Go forth and multiply. <laughs> You're pretty good at this. Maybe you'll be a behavioral scientist someday. Maybe I will. Aww. Ah, this is why she was elected to be the lookout. What's wrong with her foot? It's a broken toe. Feel free to have a look. I just have to do one more thing and then we can leave. Something's gonna go wrong. The lysine. If what is the that? dinosaurs what are, are to have a fighting chance, they'll need the solution to survive. I'm still not sure. Jerry, this is my life's work. These are basically my children. I'm not gonna let these creatures die because some bureaucrat can't stand losing control. They deserve their own lives. Jess. I mean, I guess these ones are harmless, but... Dr. Sorkin? Laura. Um, Laura, what's lysine? Ingen. 
Henry Wu, added a gene to the dinosaurs that makes them dependent on supplements of an amino acid called lysine. Without their weekly doses, they'll all die off. Don't tell my dad, but I got a D in chemistry. Then today should be very educational. The solution we were creating at the lab will reverse this scenario, allowing the animals to live out their natural lifespan. We just need to get it into the main water supply. Okay, but now you're talking about putting it into easy, the water right? supply where it's going to be the T-Rexes yes. and everything. This lady's crazy. I can handle it, Dr. Sorkin. This I is mean mad Laura. science. Okay, Jess, let's get started. They die out without getting the... Like, like that's Almost the, that's the fail safe. Forever. Yeah, right. I've never seen you refuse an egg roll. Ever. I said almost. Besides, my date was hot. You remember? The girl with the blonde hair, uh, red scarf, uh, what, what was her name? I don't keep track. Oh, you remember her. She was the one that was wearing the... Hold on. You hear that? Go, go, go! Oh. Oh! Immediately regrets his decision. Okay, okay, you win. Set the chopper down. No! You're putting Oscar's life in danger. He doesn't really like that. Jimmy! Oscar, get over here. I'll pull you in. Come on, man. That's it. <sighs> Come on. One more. She's actually trying to kill him. Tell that woman she's dead when I get in there. Come on, Oscar. Put those giant friggin' arms to work. Get in here. That's not going to help, is it, Oscar? Go, 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 go. Spam it. Stubborn son of a hey! What the hell? <laughs> He's such an idiot. No problem. You got this. Stop this thing now! Not gonna happen. I thought we wanted to land it. Ah! <laughs> Not so good. Is the water ready? Yep. Lysine is now officially a part of this nutritionally balanced dino breakfast. Excellent. Now I just need to get this water into the main supply and we'll be done. That's it, Jess. We did it. Isn't this part of the uh, later Jess, films is they don't die out, isn't it? This. And they're surprised why. I guess this is explaining that. I think, isn't number two this on a different is island, though? Intended these isn't that the reveal of number two? They had a, like, plan wow. B. With all the running away I've been doing, I haven't had time to really appreciate them. Their second island. I think maybe the third film is on the original island. Oh, Not girl, sure. Take it easy. What's wrong with that one? Oh, no. Raptors. Raptors. They make a cool sound as well. Uh. 
My left or yours? Oh my god, Dad, that was awesome! I can feel it! Music, stop. Goodness me. I guess the old man still has a few good moves, huh? You are lucky to be alive, Jerry. I've never seen anyone outrun a velociraptor before. <laughs> Wait, hang on, what do you do for fun at the weekends? What are you doing out here? Must have escaped from the quarantine. We've camp tested somehow. so many people. Are highly intelligent. They'll find a way up here if we give them They've enough. caught every yeah. single one. It's Yoder. We're down here. Down here. Down here. Stop stopping. And uh, munch. Bum, bum, bum. Was that the end? Yeah, I feel like Telltale always, their second episode, is like absolute filler. That like continued on for them. The only one, maybe like the Batman series, didn't have a boring second episode, but the others are always so drawn out. I always feel like story games should just be shorter if they don't have the stuff to fill it. It's okay. I think we're okay. Oh my god, those poor people. Mm, 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 mm. We're lucky that chopper didn't kill us all. Lonely. <laughs> I don't feel so lucky. We're trapped. Episode yeah, three. Such as Shazam? They're trying to bring the tower down. They're so smart. It'll hold. It's got to. Yeah, well, I don't want to take any chances. We need to get off the tower before the raptors bring it down. The emergency ladder's right there. The way the tower is tilting, it will put us down outside the paddock. Well, that's a start, but the fence isn't much of an obstacle for the raptors. Where do we go once we're out? I think we can make it to the utility tunnels right over there. We can lock the raptors out if we can beat them inside. I hope you're right. Oh, she's so going to get, get that eaten. Lowered. Now that she's, you know, completed her life's work and done her part. <laughs> That's the best sound. <laughs> sure, Raptor. Don't budge. Did you try the latch? The latch, right, of course. Ah, the latch. Ladders. Tool stuff. That should free it up. That's why you're the scientist. <laughs> It still won't move. It's brand new, so it might still be a little stiff. Maybe if you put more weight on it? What, you mean stand on it? Yes, ride it down. Okay, but we <laughs> should probably be ready to move as soon as She's it comes She's just back down. there with her we notepad out. Experiment number 455. Right under experiment at 454. Can a person outrun a raptor? Sweetheart, listen. I want you to be ready to climb down the ladder as soon as it's extended. Okay, Dad. Dr. Sorkin. I'll be right down. Uh, just I as just soon really as I stuck. put in my notes, what happens oh, when you no, write I this thing the down? The whole ladder is just slightly bent. It can't slide freely. We might be able to force it. it must have been the crash. Looks that way. I think we're going to need a crowbar or something to get it open. Oh, well, then we're going to have to get creative because there are no tools up here. Hmm. And let's get creative. How you holding up, honey? I want to go home. I know, sweetheart. Me too. We'll be fine. I promise. Definitely gonna have to pry it. Okay. Is there anything else here? Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> uh oh. You have to get down from here. Ah, what do we have? I love these drums in the background. This antenna could be just the thing we need to pry the ladder open. Yeah. If I try to grab it now, I could get electrocuted. Oh. Dr. Sorkin, that antenna is the only thing up here I've seen that we can use to pry the ladder open. Is there any way to turn the power to those lights off so I can grab it? Not from up here. The aircraft alert beacons aren't ever supposed to be disabled. The best I can do is make them flash on and off. How? I can switch them from nighttime to daytime operation. <laughs> They shine continuously at night. I'm just reading all of her character is just like, this is like some sick jigsaw saw-like game now. She's like, I can only make it flash off and on briefly, and we'll see if you're quick enough to grab it. In the meantime. Okay, I've switched the beacon lights to daytime mode. She's just down there Hopefully like hitting the button like this. Hopefully that wire won't be live while the lights flash off. Uh oh. Ah, oh, damn! Jumped the gun a little. Oh! What's taking so long? Listen, you little brat. Do my best. <gasps> Got it. If I couldn't move it by jumping on it, I'm never going to be able to pry it by myself. Dr. Sorkin? Yes? Can you give me a hand with this? You pry while I put my weight on the ladder. Certainly. Okay, Dr. Sorkin, I'm ready. Jess, honey, you get ready to move as soon as the ladder goes down. I'm ready, Dad. Just hurry! Okay, Dr. Sorkin. On three. Ready? One, two, three! So scary, knowing you're about to have to run oh, from these things. You gotta be freaking kidding me! Dad, what are we gonna do? Try again. On three. Ready? One, two, three. No, Jess, wait! No. She's crazy. I'm fine, Dad. Your turn, Doctor Sorkin. Right. I'm coming down. Dr. Sorkin, you have to hurry. Ah, uh, she ain't gonna make it. Run the with way, your kid, dude. Why? Oh, wait. Oh, whoop. Doesn't even matter if I do it wrong. Thanks. Okay, now up and over. <laughs> really wanted her to just land I'm splat. Okay. Run, Dr. Sorkin! Dude, stop caring about the doctor. Your daughter is with you. You don't know this woman. Oh, Dude, I love how he makes sure he gets there first as well. Dr. Harding, the door. <laughs> Nuts. Jump, Billy! Next time I get a headache like this, there better be tequila involved. No way, amigo. This turned out better than the last time you drank tequila. Yeah, you might be right. The girl I woke up next to is prettier anyway. Oh, <laughs> oh. How'd she make it out? But first, I gave her a push. I'm surprised you take the time to rescue her, what with how nice she was to you and all. Who says it was a rescue? So, we lost our ride, and the only person we managed to rescue so far doesn't even Rack work for him, Jen. Now what? See if you can find anything useful in the wreck. And make sure the girl's okay while I scout the perimeter. Ah, damn it. I left my AK inside the chopper. It's probably toast. Glad I didn't leave a round chambered. Could have killed someone. That makes two of us, amigo. 
Still, the cook-off was a hell of a show. Let's see here. <sighs> no fuel left. Must have been a hell of a blast. Yeah, I find playing as the terrible father and the Better keep team, around. like, pretty She's fun. We don't want to be anywhere nearby. These guys have been super boring so far. Like, they really... Gonna take more than an auxiliary power unit to fix it this know. time. Looking pretty safe. One so, look, cliche? Sure. Like, is that the word? It's just, like, dialogue that you've, you've heard a billion times in other stuff. All our weapons were in there. I was just getting used to that AK, too. God, I love my gun. She's ever gonna do. Should be safe to make camp here. And it's the sort of thing where I go, hmm, maybe the right, you know, maybe they're gonna have some development, but who knows? Unlikely. Oh, what's this? Must be where Oscar dragged us away from the wreck. <laughs> he better have saved me first. Is that Woody Woodpecker? Bum, 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 bum. I should see if the girl's okay. But like the B movie really comes out when it's the other characters. It's goofy, it's silly. Oscar might want to talk to her when she wakes up. Let's postpone that little reunion. Nothing else, let's see here. Hmm? Oh, is he gonna find the can? Wow, Barbasol. I have a can just like this back in San Jose. Oh man, I hope it's not for her face. Heavier than I remember. Could just be full, what? I guess. <laughs> It's only sloshing at the top. Sounds half empty, feels full. Why is that? My stepbrother used to store his second set of keys in a fake pop can. I wonder. Yeah, let me take a look in here. <laughs> the lady has a secret stash, but what the hell is it? Is it going to be? T Rex, it's leaving. <laughs> Damn it, Oscar! I only have one pair of pants. You're a hardened mercenary, sir. But just about everything in it, including our weapons, is flame broiled. No game trails, no nests. This is base camp for now. Hey, get this. I found this can of shaving cream in her pack. Didn't think you needed any. Yeah, whatever you say, fuzzy. Except it's not really shaving cream. Look. Hmm. So, now what's the plan? Nice job pulling me away from the fire, man. If I'd known you were gonna get sentimental, I might have left you. I really am surprised you saved the girl. Lady had some rotten cards. I dealt a couple. Figure next time she mouths off, I can kill her without feeling bad. We gonna try to salvage this gig? He's a softy, really. Yeah. I'm gonna go look for our friends. Uh, shouldn't I come with? We lost the guns. Means I gotta be in stealth mode. <laughs> you saying I can't sneak? I'm saying neither one of us can sneak and watch her at the same time. Besides, she won't talk with me around. But maybe pretty boy Billy can get her to open up. Yeah, it's a tough job. They always just show up to the environment that we just left. Save us. They'll smell. They open doors. Oh. 
should have stayed in bed. Dios mío. Crunch. One line is, I should have stayed in bed. Getting too old for this shit. Did nothing. Brendan Fraser. I'm in the mood to watch The Mummy again. That is an absolute classic adventure movie. I feel like we don't get movies like that anymore. I don't know what it is. I mean, it's a nostalgia thing, but I swear, like Jurassic Park, the, the Mummy, you can think of so many. The last sort of, I guess, adventure film I watched that I liked that was actually recent was that Love and Monsters, which I think is on Amazon Prime for free. Maybe, in America. Dad, are we going to stand here all day? It was pretty fun. Right we should get moving. <laughs> Locked. Smart. I love films with that vibe, though. I even enjoyed Indiana Jones and the Crystal Skull, which people hated, but I thought it was fun enough, sort of the cinema. Ay, Dios mío. How am I not dead? Bum, bum. He left me alone. Idiotas. At least one of them pulled me out of there. Not sure I'd do the same. Wait, where's Billy? Looks like I was only out for a little while. The embryo should be okay for now. They're gone. She's gonna see. Where's the cane? Yeta, no, no, no. Looking for this? That's mine. <sighs> you know, this takes me back. I learned to shave with this stuff. Give it back now. I'm all out of shaving cream myself. You mind if I borrow some? Stop shaking it. But you're supposed to shake it before you use it. Says so right on the can. You want to tell me what's so important about shaving cream, or do I ask Injun? <laughs> what happened? What with Brendan Fraser? Yeah, he has quite a sad tale, doesn't he? I'm glad to see him in uh, Doom Patrol, though. He's just a voice in that, but he's good in it. And I think, isn't he in, like, I don't know what it's called, like Yellowstone or some show like that. He was, like, some Texan guy or something for a while, I think. Glad he's still around. Make up something crazy. It, it was my lovers. He died fighting for the revolution in Chile. It's all I have of his. Please give it back. Oh, that is so sweet. So let me get this straight. Your Marxist revolutionary boyfriend made it a top priority to keep his face silky smooth. He must have been a very sensitive guy. I ain't stupid, lady. Yeah, I wonder if they'll have this again? character soften and... I feel like she's more likely Embryos. to soften up with the bigger guy, embryos. though. Because they've been so be at each other, you know? Look, Yoder. Billy, right? Maybe we can make a deal. This ought to be good. Shoot. 
be much more funny to have Billy end up alone. Please! I don't expect you to trust me, but the right thing to do is to give it back to me and let me go! Uh... I have a daughter. I need the money to get her out of the ghetto. You know what happens to girls there. She doesn't deserve that life. Are you for real? Okay. Keep talking. Mm, split the monies. There's a lot of money in it for you if I get those embryos to my contact before they go bad. Those embryos are worth over a million. That's US dollars. I have a buyer. I just need you to take us there and we'll both be rich. Oh, yeah, right. Like InGen isn't going to shine a light on an independent contractor like me when they figure out the crown jewels are missing. No sale. Tell him a story. You turn that over to InGen. You get a pat on the back, maybe a little Christmas bonus. You leave it to me. You become a rich man. Pay off your debts. Quit your job. No more guys in suits telling you what to do. Just think about it. Come on, Billy. The money's good. And you'll be helping me save my daughter. Everybody gets a little something. Okay, here's the deal. One, I'm in charge. I keep the embryo. And as Billy? soon as it's safe to break away, we'll deliver them to your contact. I don't know if the embryos will last in there much longer. That's a risk we're gonna take. Two, we're cutting Oscar in. Why? Because he's my partner, that's why. It'll be fine. Trust me. Now sit tight. Because he's up. my lo uh, partner. Gets to enjoy the sunset my partner. On a tropical damn it. With I like Yogurt. girls, damn it. <laughs> I'm just already inventing my own canon in my head that those two are together, just to make them a little more. A little more depth to it, a little more interest going on. Like so, we had with Bruce Wayne and where we the are Joker in the, the uh, Telltale We're Batman. Not far from the Marine exhibit, I know for a fact that the phone there. Because I love. Order, or at least it was this morning. Uh, working with him. Did we get there from the tunnels? I believe so. All right then, lead the way. I want to get us out of here as soon as possible. No more science projects, okay? I understand. Totally possible with how much he, they go on about girls, because it's always that compensating for something kind of thing, isn't it? Like, hey, remember that girl I woke up next to? Are you sure we shouldn't head to the visitor center, Dr. Sorkin? InGen is bound to start there when they don't hear from the rescue team. These tunnels don't run all the way to the visitor center, and I don't know about you, but I'd rather not risk any more overland travel. Good point. Don't worry, Jess. We should be safe in here. Where do all these doors lead? <laughs> Maintenance corridors. The park's essential systems are in there. Uh, electrical, water, air conditioning, you know, that sort of thing. The tunnels on this side are for transporting animals, personnel, and food. That's why they're so big. They are separate from the maintenance side to prevent accidents. So, Laura, I've been meaning to ask you, why don't you do your radio show anymore? You had a radio show? Well, it wasn't really radio. I'd hack into the park intercom and play choice cuts from my record collection. Why? Lately, I haven't had the time. Did you really have to show Artie Bridges how to do it? Believe me, I regret it. But how no wonder I this, know No how wonder they all was. escaped. He begged me, said it was his dream no to be No discipline around here. You know what, he should stick to managing the janitorial group. He is awful. He certainly is. Munch. I guess there was a reason it was just a dream. He actually records his show ahead of time so that he can broadcast during work hours. We're being hunted. Did you guys hear that? Sounded like a rat. Mm-hmm. Dinosaurs aren't the only invasive species InGen brought to the island. There are lots of rats in these tunnels. Maintenance is always setting traps down here. Well, as long as we're getting to know one another, how is it that Dr. Wu became chief geneticist over you? That's an easy one. Frogs. You're saying frogs kept you from getting promoted? Specifically, their DNA. Before DNA. we could clone any dinosaurs, we had to decide how to fill in the gaps in the DNA sequences we found. I remember this from the tour. You found dino blood inside mosquito fossils, right? That's right. I wanted a complete prehistoric genome, cross-referencing all of the DNA found in the various amber samples. It would have been safer, but would have taken time the board of directors didn't want to spend. Well, even Dr. Hammond's spare-no-expense philosophy has limits, I guess. 
Exactly. Henry, Dr. Wu, proposed using frog DNA to fill in the gaps. It was risky. We still don't know all of the effects. But it was a solution, and a fast one at that. So Henry became chief geneticist. Isn't and that I how they end up uh, the reproducing? Has anyone because, like, seen frogs have the ability to do that. I could swear I had some. I didn't realize you smoked. Normally, I manage to duck out a few times a day, but we've been preoccupied. Where did you last Damage, happen? Henry. Right here in my pocket, or so I thought. Maybe they fell out when we jumped from the water tower? I did suppose. you take the smokes, child? Oh, I'm probably better off without them. She is a thief, after all. Yes. Where is? Where are they? Where are the smokes, you little thief? You. You're so rude! Give her a smoke! Why do you do this? My legs are killing me. I suppose we could all use a break. She's like, oh, I'm dying for a smoke. She's like, suffer. I don't know how much longer those embryos will last. These we are need mine to now. My contact at the boat. We're staying here. Like, haven't you had enough thrills back. for one yeah, day? You're going to pickpocket the scientist Oscar's that you're currently fine. working with? He's coming back, and come hell or high water, we are not leaving. Uh oh. First Telltale game. Uh, we played Back Men to the Future last weapon. week, which I think Come was on, their first run. one, but no I don't time. know. Hide. Uh oh. So I thought we could check out Jurassic Park today. Get out of here, cat. Oh no. Get off my face, you stupid. What if it went in your ear? Boy. Easy girl. Dude, how smart is this Rex? Damn it! Leaving now! Feels earlier. This is uh, 2011. What qualifies as retro? That feels pretty old. I wouldn't say it was, it was retro, but. I wonder what the rules are on that. Amazing that that's so old now. Supplement? No thanks. Well, you know what? Actually, you know what? I, maybe I will. All this running around, my muscles probably need whatever protein I can give them. My thoughts exactly. I haven't gotten this much exercise since Carnival. I guess we've got a lot of extra lysine she now plays that animal the parasaurs crossing. don't need the external supply. Yeah, uh, about that. It's not just the parasaurs. We added the antidote to the main water supply. But that'll reach every dinosaur in the park. The Lysine contingency... Huh? You're insane! Denying the dinosaurs Lysine was the only safety mechanism we had to keep them out of the global ecosystem! We've already denied them the right to breed. That's their death sentence. Yes, but who knows how much damage they can do before then? A single brachiosaur can destroy as much jungle in one day as a whole herd of elephants. I can imagine the impact a group of them would have on a rainforest. Uh oh. Do I need to remind you that there are 120 miles of ocean between Isla Nublar and the mainland? The Lysine contingency was cruel and unnecessary. Tell me this. Did you reverse the Lysine contingency with the Pteranodons? No. My formula targets superorder Dinosauria exclusively. If I'd tried to account for the Pteranodons, I might have affected other reptiles. Oh, well, at least there's that. Now that I think about it, though, targeting only Pteranodons, or any one species, would be a simple change. I wouldn't even need a full lab. Am I going to have to ask Jess to follow you into the ladies' room? It won't come to that. If I decide to do it, 
I won't sneak around, and I won't involve you. I'm sorry if the way I went about it last time upset you. Well, thanks for the apology, I guess, but this isn't about me. <laughs> I want to pop a vitamin with me. She's like, hey, it's Friday night. Some lysine. Yes, the ocean provides a natural barrier, but how can you guarantee InGen won't move some of these dinosaurs to a less isolated place? This lady's got place? a pirate radio Look, station. I'll tell she's popping vitamins. When we get off the island. They can make an informed decision about if and where they want to move any dinosaurs. Do you know for a fact that none of these animals can swim? Oh, come on, Jerry. It's how Asian elephants migrated to Sri Lanka from India. There's precedent. You're being ridiculous. There's no evidence sauropods were swimmers. None. Hmm. You see them in the field every day. Have you ever even seen one of our dinosaurs try to swim? We keep them in cages, Laura. They don't get the chance. I know this. More quadrupeds can swim than can't. All right. I'll concede that it's possible there are sauropods that can swim. But I still believe that 120 miles of open water is an effective barrier. The remote possibility that a dinosaur could make it to the mainland. I don't know. I don't agree with her. I agree with him. Responsibility to treat I don't know what you guys think. Humanely. They're here because of us. I feel like she's being very silly. The audio glitches. Yeah, it's done that. I don't want to see these animals die. I really don't. That occasional but we pop all that agreed it does. to the lysine contingency. It was a prerequisite to working here. For you, maybe. But you have to remember, Jerry. I was here before there even was a Lysine contingency. At least it runs without crashing though, which is more than Detroit did for us. Henry Wu came up with the Lysine contingency, and let's not mince words, it's a kill switch, as part of his bid for the top spot. I couldn't stop it, but I never agreed to it, not even for a second. You're still here. Let's see. Continue my life's work, or let other people corrupt it, profit by it, and completely prevent me from even talking about it. This is all about Does that sound like a one choice to you? Henry for her, isn't it? No, I guess not. No matter the circumstance, you can't possibly believe it's okay to eradicate an entire species, let alone whole groups of them, regardless of how they came to be here. No one has that right. Hmm. Even if every dinosaur on the island were to die, Site B is still active. We could clone them again. What you did was reckless. I'm sorry, Jerry, but that's naive. Do you have any idea how expensive it is to clone even one dinosaur? The board won't let Hammond throw money at a pipe dream. Fine. Well, normally I'd agree with you. No one has the right to kill an entire species, but surely you recognize that this is a special case. We are responsible. Mm -mm. The new movies made Wu to be the bad guy. Yeah, he's the one that did all the testing that ended up making the, uh, whatever that thing's called. The, like, crazy smart new beast. Yes, we are responsible. Not just for our own welfare, but for the animals as well. I, I don't know, Laura. I, I, I don't know. I need to process this. I I'm gonna have to tell InGen. I understand. Are you guys done yet? Jess. Where'd you go? Here I took Just the down the hall looking at stuff. Not that you noticed, I was gone. I'm sorry, honey. I was distracted, but don't go off again like that, okay? Yeah. Always distracted. Okay. Always distracted, Dad. <laughs> no good. Here it comes. Go. <laughs> Change it up. Keep the running. Gate. Chase him. Oh no. Are we gonna see another T-Rex and Raptor showdown? Ah! <laughs> oh, that was great. Chomp. Oh dear. And again. Uh oh. Damn it. Come on. Nice, tasty dinosaur. 
leave me be. Stay still. Stay. Fight. Slip on out. Careful. I'm currently eating sushi. It's Do these very things yummy. Perfect. Stop eating? No. No. Sushi night for the old T-Rex. Oh! Oh, there you go. Anonymous Cherry, thank you so much for the 250 bitties. So much. Ever stop eating? Don't question it, just go. I what? Are you for real? Unbelievable. Oh my gosh. Gives me like a split second. Okay, so it's just up, up. Definitely not sad that they got rid of these mechanics in their later games. Come on. Nice tasty dinosaur. Stay still. Okay, up, up. Do these things ever stop eating? Me at the weekend. about as coordinated as a three-legged mule. I'm coordinated enough Excuse to me, kick did you your... see, Whoa, did you see that flip? Back. Damn, you're lucky. You ought to forget our deal and buy a lottery ticket. The embryos. Yeah, yeah, relax. I, uh... I, um... You lost it. You lost it?! It must have fallen out. This guy, huh? That's right. Go. So many characters moving around at the same time here. Locked. Good. If I can't open it, they can't either. Last thing I need is for those things to see me better. Now there's the place to hide. Oh. Damn. I swear, I, I totally just want to see everyone's death scenes, I promise. You believe me, right? Now there's the place to hide. Okay. Beautiful. How's that bandana stay on? Here they come. Stalking the stalkers. Idioto, do you know what you've done? Hey, that was such a random scene to throw in. It wasn't exactly a leisurely stroll over here. 
You drop that. You find it. Hold your horses. That T-Rex is still out there. Is it a different one to what we saw earlier? It's like white. That was a million dollar bayout that you let fall out of your pocket. Sorry, I guess I was a little preoccupied with a giant prehistoric people eater breathing down my neck. Okay, so we know where it is. Go get it. Yeah, I think I'll wait until our friend there leaves to find a new chew toy. I don't know if we have time. If the embryos go bad, they're worthless. The embryos are worthless to me if I get eaten by a damn lizard. If you're not man enough to get the embryos back, I'll do it myself. Hang on. The deal is I hold on to the embryos until we reach your contact. I know. And instead, you drop them. Yeah, well, crap. If you're going to use logic. Just go and hurry. But it 100% makes more sense to just give it at least five minutes. Like, not whilst it's still there, this... I really are a dummy. Oops. Oops. <laughs> are you gonna get eaten? You run back in. Oh god, stay still. So good. Right. Nuts. Coconuts. Dude, the timing is so funky. Oh. Uh, hello, darling. What brings a nice girl like you to a place like this? Dude, just chill. Ah, oh, damn it! Wouldn't it smash through there? <laughs> I got it. Somebody tell Carl Lewis I got some training tips for him. Okay, great. Nice moves out there. Hey, thanks. Almost makes up for dropping it in the first place. He's like, yeah, she likes me. <laughs> Squeeze yourself. There we go. What's up, Calfie? Welcome back. Same hall. Stop. True Don's in here as well. I saw eyes. Probably a rat or something. Keep moving. No, I saw eyes just like that before I was beaten. I won't go through that again. Big, shiny eyes? You saw them too? Not here, but yeah. Raptors and Trudeau. Go on, get out of here. Oh. What's up, Ellie? Come What's up, Hack? We gotta keep moving. No way! Not until I can see where I'm going. Ugh. Okay, we can't go back outside because of our old friend Rexy, but maybe we can get the lights on. It seems like those things, whatever they are, like to stick to the shadows. We're in luck. This looks like a power panel right here. What she got? <laughs> this guy didn't want the lights on. Oh. What's the holdup? It's nothing. It's just a different uh, model than I'm used to, is all. So you're stuck.
Why don't you just read the instructions? They're right there, no? Relax. This thing is just a glorified fuse box. Listen, toots, I know what I'm doing here. What about that thing there? Maybe you have to prime it before turning it on, like an oil pump or something. <laughs> Look, no offense, but this type of electrical system is probably way ahead of anything you've seen before. Okay, doll. This. this is man things. Push to close. Close what? Well, that was my best guess. All right, I got it now. Close your eyes. You're about to lose your... Oops. Night vision. What's going on? Dad? Over here, Jess. It's all right. Something even Back scarier about them to last this long, chasing all. you around no, inside, I think, not it. right? We should have been fine for days. How the hell was I supposed to know open meant turn everything off? I mean, it's counterintuitive. You would know if you read the instructions. Why don't you yell a little louder? I think there's a dinosaur on the other side of the island that didn't hear you. Jeez. Whatever. There's a close, right? There's a close, right? <laughs> I'll close that crap right up. Yeah, that's right. Who's your... Oh, oh, come on. Uh -oh. Rocket Jurassic Park's only unofficial radio station. Just a reminder before we sign off, Parklings. <laughs> Picture the wedding now. Yeah, this is actually Jurassic Park married at first sight. I've got a little something special for all you last minute Packers out there. Personal favorite of mine. And I'll see you all on board. Damn it, Artie. He's not still here, is he? No. From the sound of it, he queued up this last bit of tape and took off. So here's a little something to get you ready to set sail. Where? Oh, hello, game. Oh look, raptors on episode three. He always just accepts his fate. He's like, well. Crazy. Oh. I. Okay. Oh, push all three. There we go. Uh. <laughs> As if. It's actually, I think in Tekken, there's a raptor that you can play as. In boxing gloves. Ah, shoot. actually reduces the number of button presses needed if you die a couple of times, which is not terrible. Artie, this show is over. Laura, you are my new favorite person. <laughs> You've One of the nicest me shots so far, the Lysine problem? Don't push it. Holy crap, Oscar. Did you just take one of those things out by hand? I see Sleeping Beauty woke up. Did you have to kiss her? I woke up just fine on my own, thanks. 
right? You were in that tree the whole time. He's of jealous. course I was. He's just jealous. Anyways, when I kiss you, you'll remember it. That's never gonna happen. Oh, God. <laughs> Don't be like that. You're supposed to be at the crash site. Yeah, uh, the plan didn't factor in an angry T-Rex, so we had to change it. I didn't think to engage it in a knife fight, sorry. We had to change the plan. That's right. I unlocked the mystery behind the shaving cream can. Turns out, little Miss Sunshine here is smuggling dino embryos off the island. What? Let me guess. You have a plan. Yeah, well, turns out these things are worth a lot of money to the right people. I mean, a lot. Let's do it. You're going along with her. Hey, I'm not doing anything unless you're down. But come on, Oscar. Do you really think InGen gives a rat's ass about us? Look what happened to B Team, to Decaf. Their families are going to get a puny check, a gag order, and nothing else. Do I got to remind you we're working against the clock? There's no time to save these people and be her errand boys before this place turns to ground zero. What do you mean, ground zero? Nothing. We could do it, Oscar. We've got a call for another helicopter anyway, so one of us takes the eggheads back to the mainland and the other takes her to meet her contact. Let me guess. That last part would be up to you. You just like they're gonna you bomb the place. Like the rest of the guys they sent. Then you and I hook up later to split our cut. I trust you, but I don't trust her. Hook up later, you say? Okay, Billy, count me in. Just keep her the hell away from me. He's not keeping me anywhere. But I don't want to be any closer to you than I have to. Now, now. Play nice, you two. All right, let's move out. Take it slow and quiet. Well, let's not start this again. Right, just an extra I 10 seconds of scene here. where nothing Although, happens. To be honest, I'm a little surprised at your lack of Just in complete silence. Is she really going to sneak off to try and have a smoke? It's just, there are this so is, many oh unintended consequences that come with your decision. You are an absolute fool. We can't keep this a secret, Laura. Shift. We need like, they're not going to smell this? Oh, there's still going to be a true on in here, isn't there? Eyes what lighting up. I know it. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Raptor instead. Get munched. Plan. wasn't so lucky. So what are you doing, dude? Oh, snap. Scarred up. What the? Amazing. I've never seen them afraid before. That was awesome. Uh, no problem. Ah, blood-soaked okay, pat I'll on the head. Let the man breathe. Yoder! You're alive! We're alive. I'm surprised you guys lasted five minutes without me and Oscar. Thank you. Forget it. Oh my god, you're bleeding! Are you okay? No worries. 
belongs to Shows one more of them. affection for everyone but her dad. That's very true. That's very true. You killed one of them? With a knife? That's so badass. Well, hey, I outran a T-Rex. It's nothing. Just another fight. <laughs> Let's try and impress the 14-year-old. But they're so strong. I mean, how did you... How much can you lift? I wouldn't know. Not really a gym kind of guy. You're not? Dude, you're huge. Well, just because I don't work out doesn't mean I don't work. He just doesn't want to admit to his Sasquatch heritage. Who was it again? Granddad? Great granddad. Maybe it was your mother. <laughs> okay, stop it now. You aren't fooling me. What now? You can pretend to be a hero all you want, but we both know what you really are. You're right. We do. Why is Jess hugging the woman that held them hostage? Go back and watch Everyone, what I missed. I don't think they've actually spoken to each other since, uh, like, she was a hostage. They, The guys caught her. She was handcuffed in the helicopter. And then uh, Jess was off with this doctor. So, actually, nothing's changed between them. It's just steam, Laura. Yeah, I don't think steam can, you know, eat us or anything. You've seen the flickering lights, now the steam eruptions. Something's gone wrong with the island's geothermal power plant. That's not our problem. When the power plant explodes, it will be. It's that bad? Everything I've read about the system says it's supposed to shut itself down if something goes wrong with the steam pressure. The fact that it hasn't means that the pressure will build unchecked. It'll pop like a balloon and take half the island with it. Can we get to the power plant from here? I'm completely turned around. Yes, I've been here before. It's down this way. We really ought to get moving. Disaster movie time. How can we stop the power plant from exploding? We have to do something, and quickly, but I won't know exactly what until we get there. No time. Say goodbye to your dinosaurs, Doc. <laughs> Don't get so close. When the power plant explodes, it'll take us with it. Unless you have a spare helicopter Just invades her personal bubble. Uh, There's no time. This just keeps getting better and better. Listen up. You're going to show me the corridor that goes to the power plant. I'm going to scout ahead and make sure there's no dinosaur party happening when we get there. Can I come? I know I can help. You're staying right here where I can keep an eye on you. For the f hey, God, God damn it, for the first remember? time today. Besides, those things are afraid of him. You wandered off, Jess. Oscar doesn't mind, do you? Oscar? Ditched. Hm. Ditched. You outran a T-Rex, huh, Yoder? I sure did. You know, not everyone has the training to pull something like that off, let alone the raw speed. I know, right? That's what I thought when I outran her yesterday. When I saw the helicopter crash into the jungle, I thought you guys were goners. We're fine. Hey, uh, about before, oh, the yeah. hostage thing. I'm sorry. I was only trying to protect myself. Me and the mercs, we worked it out. Worked it out? How? Don't worry about it. We're okay. For now. That's great! So everyone's friends now, huh? <laughs> I wouldn't put it like that. Then how would you... <gasps> no way! Did you guys make out? We've decided that we can all work together. Let's put it that way. Hey, Oscar's back. What'd you find, buddy? Hallway's clear, but the door to the plant is locked. Don't that just figure. Either you got a key? I'm afraid not. This game is oh, such a glorious so mess. I wish. I swore I had some on me, but... Jess? Something to share? Stop stealing Sorry. things! I, I just wanted to borrow them. Actual kleptomaniac. But then the was there, and I threw them, and I think it ate them. Jessica Marie Harding! First, you get caught stealing a t-shirt from the mall. Then you steal binoculars from the park and lie about it to my face. Now you've taken Laura's cigarettes? You let the raptors get to us because you wanted to smoke? Hey, mom smokes. You did too, when I was younger. That's not the point. It's not just the smoking, it's, it's stealing. It's not listening. Rem Remember, the main reason you're on this island is because your mother thinks I might be able to straighten you out. Somehow. Right. Not because Jurassic you want to Park see me Jurassic Park scared straight. Look, you don't have to worry about me, Dad. I'm almost 15. I can take care of myself. I don't need you or mom or anyone. Oh, honey, I know it feels like that. Especially at your age, but 
You're not an adult. You might be a young woman, uh, uh, physically, but emotional maturity uh, Don't, takes time. Okay? I'm sorry, Dad, but how many times have you been married? Your kids. Have you even <laughs> talked to Sarah lately? This year, uh... even? Should you be lecturing anyone about emotional maturity? Damn. Burn. Uh, plant's gonna blow, right? We ain't got time for this after school special crap. That is really not fair, Jess. <laughs> Well, he said exactly what you said. <clears throat> I love the way that he, the awkward, uh, uh, phys physically. <clears throat> that vent, it may lead to the other side Women's of the things. Door. <laughs> Hate to break it to you, Doc, but ain't none of us fitting through there. Maybe. It's locked, all right. Thanks for double checking. I mean, the kid could go in the pen. Don't leave my sight until we're off the island. You aren't even listening to me. So you're smoking now. What else are you doing? I don't know about. What? Mom didn't tell you I was stripping. <gasps> That's enough, Jess. It's only until my boyfriend's death metal band takes off, then we're getting married. Mom's already signed the emancipation papers. I'm not laughing. Someone who claims she's ready to be treated like an adult probably shouldn't be such a little snob. I think we should just listen also in on the rest of this conversation. Enough! When we get you home, I'm going to be having a long talk with your mother about this. Come on, Dad. We both know that'll be worse for you than it is for me. I'm already <sighs> grounded for life, so it doesn't matter if you rat me out for smoking. It's a filthy habit, Jess. It can kill you. You sound like a public service announcement. I sound like a parent with a child who needs a refresher on right and wrong. Despite what she says. I'm not a child. They weren't even my brand. I don't know why I bothered. Oh, you have a brand. A brand? Are you kidding me? How long has this been going on? Since sometime after you left. Look, Dad, I almost died today. Like more than once. Can't you cut me some slack? Slack? So I should just let my 14-year-old daughter smoke? Oh, like hell. You're not leaving my sight until we are off this island. Or what? You gonna handcuff me? Maybe get out the trait gun? If that's what it takes, yes. Until I can trust you not to put us in danger again, I want you where I can see you. Hey, I did a lot to help us stay alive out here, remember? You promised me you would stop stealing, Jess. I just wanted one cigarette. I was going to give them back. It's not like I could just ask for one. You wouldn't have to ask for one if you didn't pick up the habit in the first place. <laughs> can we not talk about this now? Just we can talk about it later. Standing Until here, then, you're grounded. Quickly. Grounded? Are you serious? We're on a tropical island running from dinosaurs. What exactly are you grounding me from? From, I don't, I don't, at the very least, going off by yourself. The smoking is bad, Jess, but what really gets me is the stealing. I know, Dad. I'll try to stop. Jess, stealing is Oh, illegal. is she actually coming around? There's only so much I can do to protect you. And when you turn 18... Protect me? I never even see you. How can you protect me? Well, you know what? You take that up with your mother, okay? I felt lucky to get you for this trip, Damn. even if it was only because she didn't know what else to do with you. Oh yeah, blame mom, cause she made you move to Costa Frican Rica. I don't know what to do with you anymore besides just punish you. I said I'm sorry. And a judge might just give you a lighter sentence if you do that in court. You better hope so, because you keep this up, young lady, that's exactly where you're gonna be headed. Oh please, it was a pack of cigarettes. I'll pay her back. Oh, this time? But how long before you find a way to I, justify We're too deep now. We just have to expensive. see where it goes. It's got to stop. It's my choice whether I want to smoke or steal or whatever. I don't see why you care. It absolutely is not your choice. And I care because I'm your father. We don't even live in the same country. Besides, Mom's remarried now. You don't have to pretend <gasps> to want to be my dad anymore. Oh. oh, honey. Is that what you think? I don't know. You're not around. What am I supposed to think? Mom says... What does your mother say? This should be good. Oh, a second no. thought? Never mind. That's like rule number one in the divorce survival handbook. Don't fight your parents' fights. And you people call me immature. That is really not fair, Jess. Even adults don't understand everything. But my point is still valid. You're a 14-year-old kid, not an adult. That's this so is turning lame. into a don't not game your now. Your mom tell me what to do instead of trusting me to do the right thing. Trust has to be earned, sweetheart. Seems to me like you're going out of your way to do the opposite. Maybe now, but like, Jurassic it doesn't matter Park what is strange. I do. Even before I started getting in trouble, mom was crazy overprotective. She wants me home at 7 o'clock. It still doesn't excuse doing things you know are wrong. That's what makes me so 
angry about this. <laughs> I know the you know that. Yeah, but Mom doesn't, and you're not there. At least when I'm in trouble, she has to look up from her bridge game for long enough to bail me out. Yeah, well, you know what? I can't bail you out She's if neglected. you get us eaten by dinosaurs. Don't leave my sight for until attention. we're off the island. You aren't even listening to me. So you're smoking now. Oh, here we go. What else are you doing? I don't know about. What? We got Mom there. Tell you I was stripping, Jerry. That's enough. That was yes. that was impressive. Until my boyfriend's death metal band takes off, then we're getting married. Jerry, Mom's already please, signed the emancipation papers. I really papers. need to speak with you. I'm not laughing. Someone who claims she's ready to be treated. All right, enough. I apologize. I'm sorry, Jess. We will finish this later. How can I help? We have a situation. Nice. The only way around the door clap, to the power clap, plant clap. is that I love some drama. And love Jess some soapy is the drama. only one of us who might fit inside. Absolutely not. My daughter has clearly shown that she can't be trusted with her own safety. She doesn't leave my sight from now on. Get all the gas and the lore on Cherry. Oh, she's already Jess? gone. <laughs> Thank you, Kelpy, with 100 Jess? bees. It's okay. Pretty sure the dinosaurs haven't been using that vent. What vent? What? What dinosaurs? Oh my god. Jess. Bad dad. What? Well done, Jess. Thanks. Ah, oh, we're in the geothermal okay. plant. Listen up. I totally we thought we would to be like trekking the across the island to, to prevent somewhere else. any more build up. What are we looking for? A power console. And probably a master release valve. Look, Dad, I'm sorry. I was just trying to... You were just trying to ignore everything I said! Now just stay where I can see you this time. Okay. I will. I mean it. Sorry. I mean, I'm not even kidding when I say that's my current, current like, favorite plotline between the characters, is the dad and the daughter and the issues there. Because the mercenary stuff and the, like, tension isn't really doing it for me. This doctor is just crazy. I don't agree with her at all. That looks like the power console up there. But I do the want to see where it goes with those two. Surely something's going to happen where he'll like earn her respect and she'll be like, "Oh, I have a cool dad." Yeah, they're going to have to update that sign. We don't want to close the circuit without charging the capacitor first. Mm -hmm. We can't pump the capacitor until the steam is vented. Too risky. All right. Looks like we press to open the circuit in order to turn the power off. Here goes nothing. Press to open. That does make sense. It does now. We need to vent the steam before we turn the power on. So, when do we close the circuit? After we charge the capacitor. Very good. Yeah, well, you already told her the answer. How hard was that? Are you trying to tell us something, Mr. Yoder? We need to vent the steam before we turn the power on. Oh, did we just do that? First charge the pump, then close the circuit. Not your brand, eh? Yeah, I'm so sorry. I was desperate. I understand. All too well, I'm afraid. <laughs> Especially right now. But hey, maybe this disaster is just the push I need to quit. Really? Hell no. I'm so hooked I could smoke a velociraptor. I don't want to moralize, but get out if you still can. Are you going to go into withdrawal or something? Huh. Already there. Hey, do you have my lighter or did the raptor eat that too? Yoink. See that large valve wheel up there? When did this come I out? 2011. The we're looking for. I'll handle it. Which I guess was, uh, wasn't this, this was before any of the new films, wasn't it? Hasn't there been two new films with Chris Pratt? One or two? I think there was two. And I think a third one's coming out. Oh look, we can see all his scars, I guess, from his previous... I would, I'm gonna assume that's, uh, from his work with the Tigers in the past. Actually, when he mentioned that at the beginning. I'm glad that lava flow is so far below us. Any closer and the heat would be unbearable. Ah, no good. I'm gonna need some help. Could you guys give me a hand with this valve? Get big guy to do budge. it. Sure, we open pickle jars too. Mm -hmm. Drew out this year, yeah. We've missed out on so many films the last year now. Okay, on three. 
One, two, three! Stop! Stop! We got this! Oh, I mean stop! It shouldn't take that much force to turn the valve. There must be some kind of motorized assist for it. If you force it, you could break something. I'll have a look. If there is a motor, you'll need to disconnect it before it'll turn manually. Okay. Okay. Oh, looks just like a smokestack. Yeah, smoking. That compartment there. That could house the motor we're looking for. I'll check it out. We're all working as a team, look at us. Oh, oh, why are the rats fleeing? What are they fleeing from? Why haven't we shut the doors? Have we... What? How stupid are we? Motor's fried. Burnt out. <gasps> mm -hmm. Something's holding it in place. Okay, I found what's holding the motor in. Great, but we don't have any tools. Don't need any. It's just a latch. That's handy. I guess the need to yank that thing out in a hurry was anticipated. Err. I got it! Perfect. Let's try it again. We go. Yeah, this place is gonna blow. It's gonna, like, destroy the island unless we do this. Invented. All we need now is to turn the power back on. Oh, back over here. First charge the pump, then close the circuit. Pump? You, uh, need any help? I'm quite capable, thank you. <laughs> One. He's like, listen, everyone else has turned me down around here. Two. Need some help with that pump. Three. This was in the movie too, Four. wasn't it? Is that the... It's the press to close light. It means the charge is pumped. Right. I'm going to close the circuit and turn the power back on. Please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. I think you'll find we have nothing to worry about. And... Laura? Nothing to worry about, huh? It's all right, everyone. It's just a fail-safe measure to protect the plant. We probably set it off when we disconnected the motor or something else. Everything is just fine. If you say so. Oh, now we're trapped in here. Raptors! Run for the ladder, Nemo, before they can cut you off. I'm sorry. Oh. Like I'm suddenly trusting this scientist's judgment less and less. I'm not sure it was the right thing the to put controls. that compound They're into the water. Fried. Thank you. I'll These give over. Be open manually? I'm afraid not. The only way we can get them open is by using the controls by the doors where we came in. I'm on it. What? No! No way! That's suicide! He's right. Dude, the raptors wouldn't have no. come back if they were still afraid of you. <laughs> I'll just have to give them a new reason to be scared then. One of the only likable characters. You know damn well I'm the only one's got a chance to get to that control panel. Maybe, but who says you have to go alone? I do. Look, Billy, we gotta get these people out of here. I figure they got no chance with both of us gone. Damn. Crap. Okay, I want everyone to hang tight while I figure this out. You're going to be fine. What's the plan? Working on it. I'll let you know. It's the end. The end for the boys. Any more bright ideas? Alright, don't sass him. He's about, to, he's about to give his life for us, Billy. <laughs> Mm. Take a look 
over here. What I really need is for him to like pick one up above his head and fling it into the lava. I've made jumps that wide before. I could get down that way. All right. I want you to tempt those raptors by creeping down the ladder. Oh, okay. Before, I thought you were nuts, but that sounds like a great plan. You got something better? You can always throw the doctor lady down there. That would distract them. Don't go. You could die. <laughs> Don't count me out yet. It was going to be my replacement father figure. Give me a diversion, will ya? Couple of seconds at least. Got it. Hey. Thanks. Redemption goodbyes. <sighs> Also, I guess this Telltale game feels much more like a story that you play through rather than a branching narrative, which their uh, later stuff was much more S decisions that you made, you know, were supposed to make a difference. <gasps> the one with the scar is going to kill him. I knew it was weird the that they skills. showed the scar. It's going to be a revenge thing. But I respect thing. his ability. If anyone can do this, he can. <laughs> Which uh, I don't mind, honestly. I like Oscar, interactive movies, whether they're branching or not. Hey, 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 check this out, huh? Nice, tasty drumstick. <laughs> Too slow, you dumb lizard. Actually, that's it. Just keep. <laughs> Was she about to be like, actually, they're really smart. Damn it. He's like, not the time. Not the time, Doc. They could all be making noise, couldn't they? They could be stomping and waving. I did it, I swear, it's the... Oscar, get on your feet, Oscar, run! Buttons on this. Oscar, company! Hey, hey, check this out, huh? Nice, tasty drumstick. Man. Too slow, you dumb lizard. Actually, no. That's it. Just keep focused on Billy. I, I did it, man. Are you kidding? I literally press down, right, and it goes no. Oscar, company! Oh, I don't want to hear this anymore. Hey, hey, check this out, huh? Nice, tasty drumstick. Too slow, you dumb lizard! Actually... <laughs> That's it. Just keep focused on Billy. Down right, down right, down right, down right, down right. I just changed it to just down. It's like, we, you're having some issues. We'll just make it one button. Gotta make a run for it. No choice. Go. You want some of what your buddy had? Behind you! 
after all that. Oops. Gotta make a run for it. No choice. You want some of what your buddy had? Behind you! No. This guy's crazy. Run, Oscar! Come on, Oscar, get up, get up! Off for some reason. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. Oh, he's actually gonna die, huh? Nothing you can do. I was wondering if they would kill any characters. Goodness me. There's no lock. Help. Get ready. Hello. What happened there? That was their fear response. Something about this place scares them. Let me see your hand. It'll be fine. I promise. Are you okay, Billy? What the hell do you think? What Oscar did was very brave. When we get back, we're gonna make sure he is duly recognized for his- You think I care about that crap? Let's just give him some space. Five minutes, just, just give me five minutes and I'll be fine. I know what you people think of us. Bunch of blue-collar grunts, right? Bunch of high school dropouts. We're replaceable. We don't think that. We don't. Tell him. Oscar was worth a thousand of you, but he knew it. And he still died to save your ass. So don't tell me how you're gonna honor him. You don't deserve okay, to. Okay, What can we do? Nothing. I said I'll be fine, remember? All I need is space. I know we've got a lot on our minds, but whatever spooked those raptors might be nearby. Laura's right. I need everyone to be alert while she and I search the room. What is that? Hey, it smells like the jungle. Only more rotten. Jess, you don't want to see this. Nima, could you- Yeah. Come with me, Jess. Try not to look, okay? Do this. Is this her assistant? Oh my god, he's alive! His pulse is faint, but it's there. Look for bite marks. Bite marks? Yes, yes, they look just like... Just like the ones Nima had, I know. He's alive, but only technically. He's paralyzed and almost certainly brain dead. This is the Venom's final stage. Hmm. The true dons. Laura. Eggs. It is a nest. I thought the structure looked like the nest of a They cassowary. made a Maybe nest. A emu, but without eggs, I couldn't Out be sure. Them. Yes, but but they're inside him. If you'd asked me five minutes ago, 
I'd have told you such behavior didn't exist outside of class and secta, but Whoa. now... He's a human being! I I'm sorry. You're absolutely right. Grim. This guy's dressed a lot like you, Billy. Does he have a tattoo on his arm? Like mine? Oh, is this yes, the pilot? Yes, he does. What the hell's going on over there? Is he alive or not? He's alive, but in a comatose state. Something has laid eggs in his abdomen. Something what? Or just someone else who was here before, like the other guy. The victim is being kept alive. What happened to that Vargas guy, actually, that was at the beginning? I'm sorry? Oh, it is the pilot. The victim okay. is Daniel Cafaro. Another throwaway grunt. Oh my god. I knew they'd gotten out somehow, but I never thought... Knew about this? You knew? Ugh. I'll kill you! What? Da, 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 da. She's out of our hair. Doctor, what's out there? What did this to him? Tro... they're called Trodon Pectinodon. They were meant to be euthanized, but... What? You let them out? No, no! I kept them in quarantine for study. They... <gasps> I thought they may have been leaving the pen somehow, but I wasn't certain. You knew about those damn creatures all along. While we were out there, exposed, humping around like idiots looking for our pilot... Billy, wait! We were nearly killed by one of our own men. Probably bitten by one of those things just like decaf. Who knows where his catatonic body is now? Both our teams are dead. Oscar's dead. All because of you. I was just looking up. All because of you. How many chapters there are? There's only four. I thought there was going to be five. I was going to save the last two. There's only this last one left. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I wonder how long's actually left. What time is it? Uh, let's do a little bit. We'll see where this goes. Help? 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 Oscar gave you an order. Clear as day. Get these people to safety. Maybe she's not people. So this is actually the last step. Anyway, this witch is a liar. She's lied to all of us. Put me in the direct line of danger to protect her agenda and her precious freak show. What else is she hiding? Please, if I knew sooner, oh, I... shut it. What kind of soldier are you? You think about only the danger that you deal with, but we are all in this together. We could be in this without her endangering our every move. What, what, what is all this? She's a liar. How can you deny that? Hmm. How did she lie? Because she wouldn't tell us information without knowing the facts? She could have speculated. No. Speculating c could have led us into even more danger. Oh, so what? I'm the enemy? I'm the bad guy here? I'm just trying to open your eyes. I'm trying to show you the truth and bring someone to account for it. <laughs> His facial expressions. Injun is the enemy here. They spoiled the island. They made these monsters. You can't make her pay for all that Injun has done. Maybe. Put down the knife. We need to work together, all of us. All she has to say is it's my fault. It's my fault. Come on, Doc. Let me hear it. No, it wasn't. Say it! It's... it's m my fault. There. That wasn't so difficult, was it? Your friends may have saved you here. At least I got the truth out of you. You want her alive? You got her. <sighs> you just mark my words. She will save just one of those animals before she lifts a finger to help you. Now, everyone make themselves useful. Trust issues. Tend to be Look, we can't stay here long. Let's just give Billy a minute and see if we can find anything useful. A way out, even. Okay. 
We'll do a sweep of the room and check in when we're done. Agreed? Sweep. Leave the door alone. We're not going back out that way. Listen, Why not? who put you because in charge now? Because we aren't backtracking, now. and those damn creatures could still be out there. Weapons. Huele excremento. That means poop. I think they're empty. They're still heavy, though. Okay. Have a peek. I don't see anything. Maybe it's clear. Waiting for it to pop up. I don't know you. Jerry, we should get moving. Yeah, are you ready? Let's have another little look first. Well, I guess we can give Yoda a few more minutes. Might be something else in here. I don't want to get stuck in a vent with a dinosaur. Besides, there's blood everywhere. Ow! Hot! <laughs> Such a plum. Ooh, flares. A Jurassic a flare Park kit. classic. This might come in handy. Hey, hey! That's gonna happen, for sure. Are you okay? Jess, Hun, leave him alone. Eggles and his tam tam. Oh god, somebody put him out of his misery! Billy, we should cover decaf. I don't want Jess to see this. Yeah. Like, we're really just gonna take that doctor's word for it, that he's, you know, brain dead or whatever or not there. Come on, man. Do your do your friend a solid here and end that. Just great. It's locked. Anyone happen to have a key? What about this grate? It looks big enough for everyone. And it looks like it's heading in the right direction. Well... This tunnel looks tall enough for everyone. Maybe we should go this way. Jess, stand back from the grate. You don't know what's down there. I'm just trying to help. I know, Jess. I just can't keep my attention on everything at hand, plus you. He's very overprotective now, Sorry considering the rest of the... Chapters? Right, how do we get this open? Could I pick this lock? Not that I would know how. I don't want to add breaking an entry onto my dad's list of my criminal tendencies. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. I thought the dinosaurs couldn't breed. They can't. They're all female. Then how do they lay eggs? Theropod shed eggs just like most other ova um, egg-laying animals. Think about chickens. The whole egg market is made up of unfertilized eggs, right? Oh, yeah. So they still have to lay them? Oh, my. What is it? You bring up a good point about our dinosaurs ovulating, but these eggs are gathered in a clutch. This is brooding behavior. So, chickens will brood a large enough clutch? But not our dinosaurs. I've found post-ovulatory eggs in the ranges. They're mal-shaped, usually destroyed or kicked into I the like bush. I like that he's a vet. I see. Wait, it, we can't jump to any conclusions. How could this even be possible? Could a girl dino turn into a boy dino? With Dr. Wu's slapdash approach to gene sequencing, anything could go wrong. Oh, well, seems like it was a great idea for you to give them a boost to their lifespan then, doesn't it, Doctor? Jerry, we should get moving. Yeah, are you ready? Let's go. This is not the time for grieving. We have to move. Maybe we should... She's right.
How are we even going to get out of here? What is that? Another canister? Billy, did you find something? No, nothing. Is everyone ready? Is that another canister? Decal? I took care of that. It looked like you took something off him. And if he has something that will help us... I didn't find anything. I took his dog tags. Insurance doesn't pay out to his family unless his dog tags are returned. Satisfied? Right. Sorry for pushing. Should we bring him with us? Why bother? <laughs> He's already buried. Put him out of his misery. Please don't tell me you leave him like that. Look, I know where his body is. We're not equipped to transport it. Hopefully, we can retrieve his remains when this is all over. All right, listen up. Everything that just happened, bygones, understand? Doc, tell me again about the phones. Um, according to the terminal in my lab, the marine exhibit phones are still connected to the transceiver. Marine exhibit? The visitor center phones Too are- Too far away, okay? And we can get to the exhibit through the tunnels? They're all interconnected. I think I can still find- The answer is yes. Thank you. All right, we all have the same priorities here now. We get to this marine exhibit and find the phone. Oh boy. We get another chopper in the air to lift us out from there. How are we gonna get there? Trodon could still be out there. We aren't equipped to treat any more bites. We have to- Shh. I will not be shushed. <laughs> the door. Shh. Finger to lips. Oh no. They're coming through the vent! Oh! I, I, I looked away for a second. Oh, Dude, Trudon's pretty scary. <laughs> My guy, please. Stick a flare in there. They're going past the door. Yeah, those might be scarier than the raptors. Maybe we're just used to the raptors there. Oh, that was me, Starly. Yeah, that was the dinosaur. Jerry, get that grate open. Let's get out of here. I'm on it. I need something to break the lock. We'll find that something. The air tank. What? Use the air tank. It's heavy and sturdy. Ah, that'll never work. No, not that. Well, why are you even letting me click on it? Jerry, hurry! I know. I know. Jerry, Jerry, where are you looking, Jerry? Where's the air tank, Jerry? Jerry, why's the controls broken? Okay. Jerry, get that crate open! I'm on it. I need something to break the lock. We'll find that something! The air tank! What? Use the air tank! It's heavy and sturdy! What? There we go, it's working. Bash it. Come on, oh, Jerry. Jerry. Yeah. Oh, Jerry. Oh, me. I'm a little busy here. 
here. Up there! What about him? Oh, throw me one! Oh. Hearing some full on big cat noises coming out of these. Go, 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 go. Oh my, Jerry. Jerry. Embarrassing yourself now, Jerry. Please, dude. Gotta go. <laughs> Dramatic baseball slide. Division. Oh no! Which way, Laura? I don't know where we are anymore. We we need to head towards the north. North. Villas, fences, tour trackers. Eh. Do I have any idea? Wait, the conduit's gone. Don't stop. Oh, we're following a conduit. Those are water mains. Look, ah, follow. that's what we want. Which way, Laura? Follow the blue. I don't know, Jerry. We must be 40 feet underground. I have no idea where we are. Well, we can't just sit around with our thumbs up our butts. I, I don't hear them anymore. Their behavior seemed territorial. Maybe we're far enough away from the nest that they gave up on us. We might have outpaced them, but we're not exactly in a secure location. Which way are we heading, Doc? Um, look over here. Can you read these? Maybe. If I can find... Yes, yes, okay. We're at a four-way intersection. There are only four such intersections on the plan. Let me just cross-reference these detail labels. Okay, we just have to figure out which intersection we're at. Look around the corridors for any distinguishing features. I'll see if I can eliminate possibilities. Maybe I can help with the plans. They look pretty simple. I don't have enough to go on here. I need details, landmarks, something ah. unique. Let's go to the others and have a look around. Dun, 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 you. There's a big yellow pipe that goes down a bit on the left and then crosses over to the other side. Big yellow pipe. There are these two big electrical boxes of some kind on the right. Boxes? I see two ladders along the left of the tunnel. Tunnel goes straight and then turns to the right. There are these two big electrical boxes of some kind on the right. Okay. Dr. Sorkin, what exactly should I be looking for? 
large pipes, electrical boxes, tanks, ladders. Oh, even the direction of the corridor helps. Just keep looking. Okay, I think we clicked everything. There's a ladder on the right and on the far wall at the end. It looks like the corridor ends in a T intersection. Why do I feel like we're wasting flares, though? There's a ladder on the right and on the far wall at the end. There's a big yellow pipe going down the left wall. It crosses over the ceiling partway down the corridor. Okay. There's a set of water tanks partway down the corridor on this the right. This is what we want, isn't it? If we're going to the water place. There's a big yellow pipe that goes down the left wall and into the floor. There's a set of water tanks partway down the corridor on the right. This tunnel only goes down a few dozen yards to a dead end. Oh, saw something. And now it's gone. I see one ladder at the end of the hallway. Alright, let's see if that helped. Pie pee pie pee pie pee pie pee. I'll circle this one as a candidate. Okay, Laura. I hope you're right. God, do they really expect me to have remembered what was said here? Goes down and then goes to the right. I goes why? Home, home, home. How do I know what way they're looking at? We could be here. I guess they all kind of look the same. I'll just circle them all. It's fine. I think this one is a good possibility. If you say so. <laughs> Sure, Doc. Whatever you say. Just like taking care of her in a care home or something. What do you think, Jess? This one? Sure. Sure. It, it, it can't hurt. Oh dear. I actually have to look then, huh? Okay, so well, I think the one that we want... Let's try and work out this one. There's a big yellow pipe that goes down the left wall and into the floor. Yellow pipe, left wall. There's a set of water tanks partway down the corridor on the right. And water tanks on the right. So, how do we see what that is? Is there a, like, key for yellow pipe? Uh, yellow pipe. So, what, what, what one would he be on? Where is he? In terms of where we're standing. Oh. Eh. Why does it take so long to come up with the menu? Who's on here? Oh, no! Got that to look forward to, then. Um, right. The pipe, maybe he's... So if we're... And boxes. I feel like a couple of them had boxes, no? I'm just gonna cross this one off. Okay, I hope you're right. Like, what did the look like? Look down the corridors. I need to know what you see. Describe it in as much detail as you can. I see the ladders. I see some sort of water tanks at the end of the hall. So this one has water at the end. It looks like the corridor ends in a T intersection. Ends in a T. There's a ladder on the right and on the far wall at the end. Ladder on the right and at the wall. There's a big yellow pipe going down the left wall. It crosses over the ceiling partway down the corridor. Okay, so look for a big pipe on the left. I see some sort of water tanks at the end of the hall. Tanks at the end with a T section. Let's see what do we have. T section would be here or here or here or here. Tanks at the end as well would be either these of these three. And then what? Pipe? I don't see a pipe on any of those. T section means like a T shape, right? So we've got T with tanks. But where is pipe? Pipe on the... What do you say? Pipe on the left?
I don't see any pipe coming down here. Let me check with him again, see what he said about the, uh... There's a ladder on the right, and on the far wall at the end. Okay, a ladder on the right and at the wall, but I feel like they all had that too. There's a big yellow pipe going down the left wall. It crosses over the ceiling partway down the corridor. So we want a pipe that changes halfway down. How do you see a... Wouldn't a pipe on here look like these big, thick ones? Could be this, I guess. What is this? I don't think it's this one. How can you keep them all straight? <laughs> I can't, child. What do you think, Jess? Probably not this one? Yeah, I don't think so. That's the secret. Nobody knows okay, what everyone, they're doing. Okay, everyone, I think I've got it. Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah. I'm positive. Yeah. 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 We yeah. must be here. It's the only one. Fake that it till you make it, baby. Surroundings. Okay, here we are. The desalination plant is here. We're not that far. No, we follow this route here. We follow any water mains at junctions in the direction of convergence. Even still, there's barely any turns. Look, just memorize this route. Where is it? Here. Is it going to be Scar-Faced Raptor? What is it? Oh, damn. <gasps> oh, my God. Yeah. I thought he was going to die. I feel like the cat sounds really don't suit the Trudons. Split up. Left his daughter again. But of course he did. Oh God, Jess! Oh, what have I done? I just left her down there. I have to go find her. What's up, V? Back down there with those monsters? No, Jerry. She needs you safe. Jess is a strong and resourceful girl. She's doing like we are doing. Surviving. You can't know that. I won't leave her to those animals. Jerry, look at me. If we go back down there, we won't make it to the bottom of that ladder. The others escaped down the tunnel we were going to follow. We know where they're going. The marine exhibit. That's where Laura would take her. And Yoder is with them. Oh, God. If we're going to join them again, <laughs> that is where we have to go. Oh, the God. The quickest way we can. Not Yoda. We should be able to make better time over land. Can you get us there? Sorkin mentioned the desalination plant. That would be near the ocean, right? Jerry, the whole island is near the ocean. Oh, right, but we pump seawater in from the lagoon. They must have built the marine exhibit near the waterworks. Lagoon? I think I know where that is. Let me get my bearings, and we'll figure out how to get there. What are those sounds? Like whales. Do you know where we are? Let me think. It's been so long. This is my first time back on the island in nearly 12 years. Engine has changed it so much. I don't know what your relationship to InGen or this island is, but we have little time. You think I do not know this, Jerry? I'm doing my best to help you and your daughter. You're right. I'm sorry. 
I grew up here, you know. <laughs> the least you can do is listen to my story. My people were fishermen. We would make our homes listen. near the water during the fishing season. I love the water. I would swim in the ocean. So far. That's why my father called me Nima. I could go anywhere. Yeah, uh, Nemo, huh? Climb the trees. These monsters. There was never anything like them on this island before. It was all very peaceful before Injun bought the island from Costa Rica. What does your name mean? It means little fish. You know, like uh, the ones that have so many colors. Mm -hmm. The island is so different now. I know the island. It's part of me. Is that where uh, uh, finding came Nemo island, comes from? Important men from Costa Rica came and asked my father to go back with them. They wanted my father to make a good impression so that Costa Rica could ask Ingen for a good deal of money for our island. When he was in Costa Rica, he was asked to cut his hair and wear a suit so that he wouldn't seem simple to the Ingen people. I felt as I feel now. My father was different. I knew him, but some part of him had been lost. Uh huh. My father was an Awa, a spiritual healer. He sang for Sibo, who created the earth. He was very important to our tribe. But after we left the island, he would not keep up the old traditions. He was always unhappy. What is Sibo? <laughs> that mountain there. I'm just imagining in Jerry's it like head, he's like, I want to. I want to get out of here, but I don't want to be animals rude. The world built it. Before Injun. Uh, my this father sounds and I like would go to the ocean cultural to fish. stuff. When I would swim in the ocean, my, my mouth father shut. would say, Nima, little fish, little fish, do not swim so far. I cannot catch you so far out. When Injun came to move us to Costa Rica, I became very angry with my father. Whatever he would tell me to do, I would refuse. But he would never be angry with me. He would say that I am a fish who would never eat the fisher's bait. He was right. To me, everything had a string attached. You remind me of Jess. I mean, that's how it used to be with us before the divorce. I'd take her to the museums or to the zoo. She'd always climb up onto things, you know, such a climber. She can't not climb over things, into things. Climbed into a tiger pen once. <laughs> with a live tiger. But not anymore. No, That's probably how he got the scar. Been the same since the divorce. Do you still blame him for everything? No, I have forgiven him. I know to blame Injun now. He would always remind me of my stubbornness. I think I believe that's how I must always be. You know, no ties, no temptation. But then I had Atlanta, my Mariquita. She is almost of an age where she will outgrow my protection. Young girls on the streets in my neighborhood. They get snatched up by local cartels, run drugs. Or worse, some just disappear. Now there is no choice. Everything I Enough do, talk. I do for her. Just leave it till that moment. Now I am the fisher. And at the same time, I have come to a way in my life where I must always chase the bait. You named your daughter Atlanta? Yes. It's a beautiful name. I named her after the city. That's where I will take her after this job. That's a good strong name. And a good city. I want for Atlanta to be free. I want for her to have opportunities that I didn't have. I just hope I can be there for her the way my father was there for me. Listen. She can be stubborn like her mother used to be and refuse the Fisher's Bay. I think I know now it's a good way to be. I think that my father believed that too. Nice well, shot. you've turned into quite the capable woman. Your father must be very proud of you. Thank you, Jerry. I... I should have realized that sooner, though. I'm sure he knew. <clears throat> so, look, I... I uh, what is it? Hmm. Nima, I want to trust you. Help me get Jess off this island, and I will do whatever I can to help you and your daughter. I could not hold you to that, Jerry. If we don't get off this island, you might not have to. Please. All right, Jerry. Enough talk. 
You know where we are? Jerry. I love how everyone has to say his name every time. It's a time. difficult hike. Do you feel rested? Hungry. Jerry. A little thirsty, but I, I just want to get to Jess. Good. Shh. Ah, if only we had moved sooner instead of stood here and had a story for five minutes. Guess Dilophosaurus? Hello? That was actually the call of a whooping swan. Dinosaurs shared many features with modern day birds. For instance, we now know that many theropod dinosaurs from the Jurassic period's vocal organs are just like modern birds. We are arriving at the fourth of seven. The writer of this game had dreams of being a teen drama series writer, definitely, and they were only allowed to flex it on like two scenes, so they just put everything into that. Next stop, the Jurassic Park Marine Facility and Aquarium. Hey, that's where we want to go. Doctor definitely not making it. Would you look at this? Her admitting it that it was her fault was like sealing her fate entirely as a character, I think. What are they? They look like feeder tanks. This could be a hatchery. A hatcher what? They're raising these fish to feed another animal. Like at Marine World. Like the killer whale? The hatcher who? Precisely. That's a lot of fish. How many whales are they feeding? I don't know. It looks like each of these tanks could feed three or four I orcas per day. Oh, well, you're a fish expert now. I can make an educated guess. Look, there's a sign over there. It looks like a schedule or something. This is a hatchery. That's the stocking schedule for the tanks. Some tells me these fish aren't for feeding whales, huh, Doc? It's gonna be the big boy. Hold up. I hear something. <sighs> All clear. Jess. Oh, thank God. That was quick. Are you okay? Are you hurt? No, I I'm okay. Just, can we go home now? I'm so glad you two are safe, Jerry. How did you manage to get here? We climbed out of the tunnels through a service hatch near one of the tour routes. Luckily, someone left the tour program running. Thanks. You mean... Dr. Sorkin, the phones are not working. I'm sorry? There is no dial tone. You said the phones would be working here. That's odd. My control terminal showed that the main lines here were active. Unless... Of course. Everything is controlled by the computer systems, even the phones. If the power outage outlasted the battery backups, then the system is probably just waiting to be booted up. Get us to the phones, Doc. We don't have a lot of time. Mr. Yoder, I refuse to be pushed around by you any longer. Look, this isn't a day trip. If we don't contact InGen and get another helicopter out here for you all, the next flight over the island is gonna be a wing of B-52s carrying holy hellfire! What? That's right, Doc. They're gonna murder all your precious little pets and sink this island into the Pacific. Dios mio! That's what you meant by Ground Zero? Yeah, that's right. Why didn't you tell me earlier? Casual. This is my home! <laughs> what do you mean, your home? I didn't tell you earlier because I thought we'd be off the island by now. This island is the ancestral home of her people. Wait, what is Dr. Sorkin doing? Laura. Oh, dog. Wait, what are you? Where is she going? I don't know. This rotunda. It's where His the expressions. Billy's expressions it's are like so accentuated. Us. It's yeah. like when Get Mass Effect bugs out, and people always use it with the thumbnails, with like the eyes popping out of their head and stuff. Oh, they've really made a lot of progress in construction here. Paleozoic, huh? Well, most of the specimens here aren't really from the Jurassic period anyway. <sighs> ah, Paleozoic. From oldest to newest. Cambrian, Ordovician, Silurian, Devonian, Carboniferous, Permian. This is what we have waiting for us. What is that supposed to be? I don't know. 
Looks like a Mosasaur. Mosa. Mosa, what? It looks kind of scary. <laughs> sort of Did a, you say a sea lizard of sorts. You think of a um, big moray eel with a crocodile head. Croco eel? Great. Sounds charming. Don't worry. There are no sea creatures on my list of park animals. Then what are all the feeder fish for? Feeder fish? Yeah, we came through a big room filled with tanks of fish. Secret Nora aquarium that nobody knew animals, about. Like what? whales. Hmm. Well, let's not jump to any conclusions. Hmm. Interesting concept. Living fossils. I guess you can't expect a mosquito to feed on fish swimming hundreds of meters under the sea. This little pool is cool. Were these creatures all cloned like the dinosaurs? No, these aren't actually extinct it's animals. Like some... They live in the oceans today. They're called living fossils because they haven't evolved much from the ancient fossil Six-year-old kid and her dad found a fossil oh, footprint is that a horseshoe recently. Hey, hey those are an animal honest, crusher. I don't really know all that much about sea fauna. <laughs> fauna. <laughs> Why has she suddenly got three brain cells? What happened here? How are you holding up, Jess? I can't stop shaking. I'd literally rather be back in jail for shoplifting. I'm just so tired of running, Dad. I know, I know, me too. But we're safe for now. <laughs> but I always think it's so cool that like stuff is still there I'll to be, be discovered. Info, People Jess, can okay? find yeah, fossils Dad. and stuff. When I was small, we used to go to a couple of places in the UK where we would Information. look for fossils sure and stuff use them now. along the beach. Huh. Very clever. Looks like they're using numbers from the dates of the Paleozoic era as daily key codes. Uh, okay. What day is it? So the plaque for the Paleozoic era preceded the oldest period at the display. Maybe the sequence doesn't start at the beginning of the week. Huh? Today is Saturday. Okay. I need Friday's code. Right. Which uh, could be what? Silurian. Silurian. Good a guess as any. I'm not too sure. So wait, it's what order they're in? On the thing? Paleozoic, Cambrian, Ordovician, Silurian, Devonian, Carboniferous, Permian. Dude, slower. Or not at all. It's you know you don't have to read it if you don't want to. Just... Paleozoic, Cambrian, Ordovician, Silurian, Devonian, Carboniferous, Permian. <laughs> it's going. It's going in one ear and out the other. I'm not even going to pretend. I'll be over by the info desk, okay? Yeah, Dad. <laughs> Me skipping the rest of the Back to the Future episodes today because I didn't want to do any puzzles. There's enough here for me to deduce the order. If I can just recall the order of the display. Okay, so that's where it starts. But what's before that? Permian was at the top, wasn't it? Right? Hang on, go back. Oh, what is that mnemonic? Um, camels often sit down carefully. Perhaps they're... If it starts at yeah, Paleozoic. Yeah, yeah. Ordovician. So then I guess... Oh, there's like three missing. So what was after Ordovician? I think it went Silurian, Devonian, Permian, right? Permian. Sounds right. Okay, best guess. Bum 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 bum. I mean, try it, why not? Oh good, instructions. Insert operator's key into key slot. Okay, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. Code expires in 24 hours. Morning operations reset procedure. Turn key counterclockwise to input notch and hold for three seconds. Keypad will reset and beep three times. Turn key clockwise to reset. Enter previous code, then new code. Huh, that's easy enough. 
Bum, 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 bum. What would the doctor have to gain by leaving us here to die? I mean, I don't know. She seems to be, uh, just like Billy said, actually, prioritizing the lives of the creatures. And maybe she wants to get to whatever is in here before us. Because this guy doesn't even know that there's marine animals in here. Does it really think I listened to what it said on the manual? Okay. Nine, two, five, one. All right, new code. Let's keep it simple. Genius. Relax. See what? Damn it, you careless idiot. She's gonna uh, steal it. What was that thing? Some kind of spy gear? Yeah, She's gonna yoink. That's right. Top secret. In fact, if you tell anyone about it, I'll have to kill you. You won't lay a finger on her. I was just kidding around. Everyone, I got the elevator working. <sighs> about time. What's going on here? Nothing. We're all cool. Probably literally gonna be the last shot will be them being like, What? Where's it gone? Da -na 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 -na. And she's like, Look what I got, Dad. Oh, jeez, get over it. Let's go. We don't got all day. That's great, sweetie. We need to make our own dino zoo at home. Oh, he's just like, he's like, oh, you. Dad, Freeze frame. Ears. What's going on? Roll credits. Rotunda and Spectacular is housed in a pressurized underwater environment. I guess stealing's not all bad. To equalize your ears while we descend. If you experience any lasting discomfort or feel unusually giddy, let your attendant know immediately. Giddy? They're talking about nitrogen narcosis. It's a risk of breathing pressurized air. What makes you the expert? I, uh, saw it in a movie. You didn't even know what a hatchery was, like, less Whoa. than two minutes ago. Is that where we're going? I think so. My god. What I wasn't expecting any of this. This is so cool. Careful, I'll lead. Something's gonna go wrong. Cool! Look at that! Oh, don't look at it, don't look at it. I want to speak with Hammond. Where is it? We're gonna see it. No, this can't wait. Can you connect me to Mr. McGuire? Or no, Peter Ludlow. The Please most. hurry. No, look, this is Dr. Lawrence. Oh, I have a bad I feeling about this. Park. I am still on the premises. Get me somebody. I hope the doc gets eaten by it. Mr. Parker, I do not need rescuing. I do not want the bombing waylaid. I want it stopped. What? It's not contaminated. This is a wild. It's locked from preserved. the inside. These animals are not diseased. They are extremely endangered. You're not listening to me. So she ran off to call them to try and stop the bombing, but why would we have even hey, Dad, cared? This looks like an intercom up here. What? Where? What's up, Grit? How you doing? Good find, honey. Laura, it's me, Jerry. Laura? Jerry, I hear you. 
and I'm glad you're here. This is going to be a lot easier now. What? What have you been doing? We're going to stop the bombing, Jerry. This island must be preserved. What's she doing? I have taken the remaining survivors hostage. There are four others, three Americans and one Costa Rican. I won't let them go unless the plans to bomb the island are completely rescinded. You have no right to hold us like this! Rights are just an ideological construct. Don't turn this into a, a philosophy debate. What rights do the dinosaurs have? Don't they have the right to survive? Do their rights outweigh any of ours? Dino it is not our rights. rights versus theirs. Our dinosaurs are phantoms. Majestic as they may be, alive as they may be. We brought them into a world that is no longer prepared for them. We have a responsibility to keep them isolated and under reign for the safety of our ecosystem. It's not rights, it's responsibility. And we have a responsibility to preserve our creations and allow them a chance to survive on their own terms. We've got to do something. Like what? We're stuck between two locked doors. We wouldn't be in this mess if I had killed her when I had the chance. If you don't offer me some sort of guarantee that the island will be preserved, I will have to escalate matters. Villainous. This is lunacy! Fine, put the military on the phone. Hello? Hello? You want to see contamination of the global ecosystem? Oh, uh, you're nuts. What are they saying? Are they going to stop the bombs? Laura, there are other options here. Holding us against our will to save the dinosaurs is only one poorly thought out solution. You're smarter than that, Laura. I know, Jerry. I know what I'm doing. I clearly express the consequences of threatening this island. I scored a line in the sand that has been ignored and trampled over by InGen, by the government, and like, now this is why Henry I got the job, Laura, resolve. and not you. Just Laura. saying. I'm going to free the Mosasaur. Are you mad? A land dinosaur paddling to the mainland is one thing, but you're talking about releasing an apex predator into over 70% of the global ecosystem. It's only one. It can be recaptured. Before it eats the last of the humpbacks? Oh, don't be dramatic. Laura, don't. <laughs> She's... She's the worst. <gasps> Here it comes. Plan B. Don't be stupid, Billy. What is... Are you going to end up... Fine, this is the most effective chopping method. I'm sorry, Jerry. For the sake of this island and the scientific treasure it holds, I have been forced to take an action. It's not too late. We can reverse this. No. I locked the system oh, now. Baby. There's nothing you can do. I've opened the gates and the Mosasaur is free to leave. Laura, you have to- No, Jerry, this isn't up for debate. We have to show InGen- Look out! Bye. Bye. Get out of the water. Damn. Dinked her head on the way. Damn it. What were you thinking? All right, everybody. Be cool. And stay away from the window. Be cool? Cool? That's right. What? You want an I told you so? I don't know about you, but I came here to make a phone call. We're so going to end up in the water. It's happening, for sure. Hello, this is William Yoder, ID 4122. Put me through to Haskell. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, the U.S. Embassy. Report as follows. The island is completely overrun. Alpha team killed in action. Save one, myself. Bravo team killed in action. Two helicopters disabled. 
two civilian casualties. I have access to a seaworthy boat, and I will evacuate the remaining survivors. Yes, sir. The military may proceed. 90 minutes. Understood, sir. Well, that's a while. Thinking, Billy. What's happening? Who did you call? That's far enough. What? You're not coming with me. There's going to be a tragic accident, Jerry. Oh, Nima, Billy. We have everything we need. We're finishing this without them. What? No. What do you mean, no? We've got an agreement, remember? An agreement doesn't involve killing Jerry and Jess. What's going on? I'm sorry, Jerry. I was sent here to retrieve dinosaur embryos from InGen. I... I don't understand. You're... you're a corporate spy? Yes. Damn it, Nima! I trusted you! It's not like that. Yoder took the can. He wants it for himself. I'm trying to help you and Jess. What can? A can of shaving cream. It has a compartment to smuggle the embryos off the island. Damn it, Nima. You're blowing it. No, you are. Oscar put his faith in you. He may have been a devil, but he wore his sins on his arm for everyone to see. You, you are just a mask with nothing behind it. No, you can't do this! Don't you care? Don't you care about Oscar or Decap? That's enough! You're gonna punch the axe <laughs> I'm gonna give you a sporting chance here. Billy, Once wait. I let go of the spoon, there ain't no coming back. Don't do this! How is he suddenly... Run! ...so evil? Like, what the... All this way, dude. Hey, charismatic goof, wise guy, and then... Son of a... Come on, get up! That 2D switch. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> Jerry's pose. Do it, Jerry. The roll was unnecessary, but smile point. Here comes the monster. And also, she totally stole the can. And that was him realizing that. I have to swim for it. Is anybody hurt? Is everyone all right? You mean, besides being trapped in this bubble by that desgraciado? We're as good as dead. Don't say that. Somebody might, somebody will come for us. Oh, Jerry. Yoder left us here. He'll take the boat How and scared would you us. be if you had to swim that? Oh. Maybe he won't take the boat. He has the canister. I he think I would rather stay in the bubble. He, uh, doesn't have the canister. Uh, what? I'm sorry. I promise not to steal anymore. Okay, but... that one's a freebie. Jerry, look! Oh, great. Oh, Just no. great. Worst nightmare. Why is it flooding? Must be the damage to the door. We're losing air pressure. This place will flood right up to the highest hole in the room. Damn it! Even if we could open the door against the pressure, the whole rotunda is flooded. There's nowhere to go. Wait a second. I remember. Maybe there still is a way out. If we swim. swim. Swim? We won't make it 20 feet with that Mosasaur swimming around. Maybe. Look at that pipeline. It leads out of this lagoon. There are caves at the far end. Those caves connect to others that lead back to the beaches. 
We use the pipeline as cover. And you think we can hold our breath the whole way? Dad, look, there's diving gear. No, 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 no. We don't know the first thing about scuba diving. I do. What? We have to distract the Mosasaur. Figure something out and meet us back down here. Scuba diving? Oh, dear. Oh, come on. How could this be so complicated? I don't know thing one about diving. Dad, don't mess with the mixture valve. They're all preset. Since when do you know about diving? Remember those lessons you wouldn't let me take? Did your mother override my decision? Um, actually, Steve bought Steve. me Steve! It was a secret. Mom's boy. Steve! Boyfriend. Yeah. If it's any constellation, I got grounded and Steve slept on the couch. Secrets with Steve. Unbelievable. I'll be right back. Feeder program. Hmm, distract it with food. Actually B, pool four. That looks like the one scheduled for today's feeding. <laughs> that ought to keep it busy. One little morsel. Okay, hon. What do we do? Dad, I changed my mind. These are rebreathers and I've never actually used one. I'm not ready for this. Hey, you can do no. this. No! What if something goes wrong? I don't want to do this. I don't want anyone else to get hurt. Jess, I, I know I don't say this enough, but... I love you. Maybe I seem so overbearing, but it's because Sarah got away from me. And I don't want the same thing to happen with us. No, right now, all that matters is that we get through this. Everything else, we can work that out later. It's small stuff compared to this. I just... I just don't want you to go away. I'm so tired of you always going away. I know, honey, but I'm here right now. And I'm not going to leave you alone. I'll be here with you all the way. Now, what's the diver signal for okay? It's universal. Duh. Oh my god. Oh, right. Right. Well, I promise to signal you whenever <laughs> you check we're in the out, moment. Okay? I'm scared. If I could have told you that I loved you, say it back. God. As scared as that time you accidentally walked into Uncle Wallace's room while he was washing his nose? It was so gross. I didn't know it was, like, prosthetic. Okay, Jess. You ready? Yeah. Let's do this. So, how do these things work? Well, these are closed circuit rebreathers. They look That was really design. moving up until the moment that we made fun of somebody with a prosthetic nose. Are oh, you watching Jurassic Park right now? Nice. I'm definitely going to have to do a original trilogy rewatch, I think. This is the regulator. It's built into the mask. It wants to help you breathe. Don't fight it. And don't hold your breath. Okay, don't hold my breath. The tank is small, maybe 15 minutes of air. Is that enough? But it recycles the air you exhale. It should work for about 45 minutes. Try not to freak out. You use air faster. You might even mess up the CO2 scrubbers. That sounds bad. CO2. I will say, right? I know that this totally has been um, That's it. The suit's mostly really ropey in places, which is what like we expected anyway. I thought it was going to be oxygen. pretty bad. But it's oh, the fact that we're going to finish the whole thing. Don't it's been a lot better than I expected. Sharks. What about Moses? Like it's been fun. Probably them too. Turn around. I thought I would maybe do two episodes and then just kind of be like, well, that was terrible. But it's been enough of a, a laugh that I wanted to see it through. I think loving the, the IP helps. Loving that it's Jurassic Park and going through that. If it was just any old story, I probably wouldn't be as into it. Oh, this is awful, dude. I hate water. Oh, God. Oh, ah, buttons. Okay, keep it swimming. It's so quiet under here, too. Oops. Oh, no. What does that mean? Where is it? Why wouldn't you be keeping your eyes on it the whole time? This is awful. I would just be hugging that pipe. I would not want to be anywhere not 
Oh wait, like open water that it could get out. Oh. This is terrible. Oh no, stop. Jerry. Oh. Stuck. What an idiot. Stop struggling, go backwards. It's like ringing the dinner bell. Which character is in the blue? Who is this? Oh, that's terrible. Ramming speed. So much Amazon D coming in with the support, which is all of our reaction to this Mosa right now. Look out, look out, look out. Oh no, my mouse has disappeared. Oh no, why is it broken now? The mouse is gone. Um, thank you so, so much. Amazon D coming in with the support. Get the love and the hype in the chat for coffee and pancakes afterwards. It sounds like a plan. Thank you very, very much for the generous support. Appreciate you. Thank you. Okay, let's see if I can make my mouse come back. Here it is. Come on. This is how we live now. Nope. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm just gonna have to leave it where it needs to be, which is here. I didn't alt tab. Why is it broken? Can't wait for some pancakes. I've got to show you guys my coconuts too. Have a refreshing sip. Works, leaving it where it was. Here we go. Tricked it. Oh no. Oh, I hate this. There's so many death states now. Like, we need our game to be just a little bit longer. Still in the same place. Oh, fluff me, dude! It's down and then left. Yeah, I got some nice fresh coconuts that you can put a straw in. Oh, I moved the mouse. Hang on, where is it? Here. About there, I think. Look at 
looking for his dinner. Chumpy, chumpy, chump. Swimming together like a little school of fish. I have to wait for it to look away. This scene's so quiet. What's the other button say? Oh, left and then down. Oh, it was like two choices and obviously shooting that thing with a little harpoon was the wrong choice. Sherb was a dino. Sherb, I think, would have to be... I feel like he'd suit being a little dealer, actually. I was cute. I make cute noises, but I was sassy. And spit at them. <laughs> Sherb. Sorry. As a spitting goat. Look, by the lighthouse. Yes, that must be it. We made it. Wait, did we just trap the Mosa in there? I completely tuned out for a second. Wait, we shut that gate. I don't see anyone on it. Maybe a dinosaur ate them. Have we stopped Maybe the Mosa from escaping? <gasps> well, well, well. Fortune smiles upon the brave. Hey, Dad! I thought I'd worked everything out. Hadn't accounted for a little thief here. Well played, Jess. Well played. But then, I was sure I had buried my ticket off this island at the bottom of the sea. But, lo and behold, you slippery sons of bitches survived. Wait, 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 wait. Did you, did you swim out of there? You bastard. What will your bosses think when they learn that you tried to murder us? But they won't learn about it. Oh, she's going to kick his butt. one way or another, you're not going to tell them. I just don't know how we got to this point, Nima. You were the last one of my kind I thought I could trust. Things didn't start out that way, but we had worked out a mutually beneficial deal! But now, I don't even have that. All that's left for me is that damn canister. Now hand it over, Missy. Ah! Nice one. Almost hurt. You looking for this? You know, things don't have to be this way. We'll kiss and make up and share this payout just like we planned. <laughs> I mean, at least they did. I mean, I would take him suddenly this like two dimensional switched where he's the bad guy over them somehow ending up together. I am sorry I did not see your true self long ago. I could have saved us all a lot of trouble and kicked your ass to begin with. Oh. Oh, come on, don't make this easy for me. Come on, Nima. You're a merc, just like me. You got bills to pay? Are these two really worth all this? Hmm. 
It's not about the money anymore. I'm not gonna let you hurt these people. No more talk. Shut up and fight. Damn it. I pushed it. I'm sorry, Dima. Oh, really? Bringing out the blades, huh? Oh, it's so quick! How does it expect me to see what it is and do it in time? Oh no, the electric fence! Is that thing on? Are we gonna fry him? Ten thousand volts would do more than just go. Bzz. More than a little sting. Ever been electrocuted? A boom. <laughs> oh, Why did go. you announce your attack with a wall cry? Go, go, oh, go, go, go. Huh? Oh, what? it's running. That, what's that? I can have it? Why so generous all of a sudden? No. <sighs> you want to be the hero? Just. You want to break our deal? Oh, of course. You feel that? Jurassic Park classic. Oh the T Rex to no. the rescue. You want to make new friends? A T Rex. Yoda! And Nima, I don't like it. Every time. Fool. Why would you ever, Billy? Why? to the park. Playing hot potato with this thing. Oh, I didn't realize that was the choice I was making, I'll be honest. Nemo, I'm sorry. I didn't actually... Another go? Do I, do I do I get another? Do I? Can I try again? Oh no! <laughs> no! She wouldn't do that. How do I go back? If I go back, where will it take me to? Oh dear! I didn't realize that was the choice I was making. Any unsafe progress will be lost. But you're not telling me where I'm going to. What? Uh, wait, hang on. Let me not press anything. If the kid dies, then it will reset. Oh, man. Come on. Just stand there, Jerry. Do me a favor, please. Thanks. Oh, 
please let me have another shot. Uh, oh, it's not going to let me choose again. Oh, oh actually annoyed. That's so... Why? You make a big decision like that with just arrows on the screen? Ah, oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry, but like the game teaches you the entire way through. If you see an arrow, push the button. And then in the last episode, it introduces that actually some of these button pushes could be the wrong thing. Like, with the shooting of the gate to close on the Mosa. And then this. It's like the only two choices that have actually been choices. Everything else has just been push the button when it appears to get through the story. That's ridiculous. That's bad design. Oh, wow. Well, it's really awkward without the music. So mad. Nima would have never... Also, for such a big character to get thrown away like that on a button push is crazy. Well, what are we doing? Go inside, Jerry. so far. S oh, I didn't... Snapped from the crotch. Look at that. Yikes. Everything's a fail at this point. I'm definitely gonna have to go and see what Nima's ending is. Lovely view at least. Jerry running in the background. It's amazing. Munch, munch, munch. Come on, Jerry. Steve can't be new daddy. Let's go, Jerry. You don't want Steve raising your kid. Make it to the boat, man. Oh, God. Oh, no, Jerry. <laughs> Jerry, no. Oh, that's the ending! Oh no, it actually isn't a fail state. Oh 
god, it has to be. Surely she can't be the sole survivor. This is no, 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 no. Go back. Okay, phew. Oh god, imagine. <laughs> until dawn all over again. Damn. Yeah, that would have actually been hilarious if he died there. I'm sorry. God, what if they just get... Well, maybe they'll see the Mosa now? Or maybe it still got out or something. Final sting in the tail here. Hey, she had a difficult decision to make. We don't always get to do the right thing, honey. I didn't even know what the decision was. Yeah, I guess. What now, Dad? I guess you're kind of out of a job. That's all right. I quit. No more dinosaurs for me. I think I'll try to get my old job back at the Dallas Zoo. Elephants are a little more my speed, anyway. Coming back to Dallas? Why not? Think it's a good idea? If you're serious. All right, then. Dallas it is. But first, I have a promise to keep. There's a little girl in Costa Rica that needs our help. Oh, he's still gonna help the kid. Tragic. Ah, Jurassic Park. Well, I thought this was a pretty fun adventure. I have to say, I didn't expect to do the whole thing today. Six and a half hours. It's not a bad runtime. It's shorter than their other games, I think, but this was their first foray into this. 